Hello, no fancy intro today because we're doing this one as a nice little, uh, just a nice little ease back into some second yeah. channel content. How are you doing, Chuck? I'm doing good, brother. What about you? Yeah, good. Me and Chucky have just uh, filmed a, an ad read for the main channel and it, it was good fun. <laughs> it was good fun. We uh, we have fun here at TPD TV. We do indeed. Um, about two years ago, maybe, we did the crisps tier list. Yeah, it's about two years ago. It was one of our more well-received videos. Yeah, we've, absolutely. We've talked about doing another tier list for a long time, so let's just jump in straight away. We're going to do UK confectionery and sweets and stuff. Oh, I can't wait. So here we are. Well, Why don't I, you see get started? A, I see a couple of things on that list yeah. that I might have already brought with me. Okay. So not only do we get to try some of these sweets. Right. We get to try them and then rank them instantly after. Instead of just having to use the old, like, noggin to rejog the memory. So We've got uh, some live... Uh, some live treats. Some live tasting. Some, some live tasting. Let's see what we got first. Up first is... Ooh, a Tang classic. Tang Fastics. Yep. All right. A staple. These, to me... Cracking them open straight away. Straight away? <laughs> it's not, Tang Fastics not the first one on the list. Oh, I thought we just went from whichever one it yeah, was. Yeah, okay, do you know what? Yeah, you know, I'm pretty just hungry. try it. Oh, I've opened these like like a criminal would. There you go, mate. Bon apple teeth. Yeah, so I'm going to go for the this one here. Oh, I'm going to go for the cherries. The cherries always be my favourite. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. These are good. They are good. These are like... The type of sweet that you want just like to get that little fix in. Maybe not what you want to eat a whole packet of. But when you're just like, I want a nice sour, yeah, sweet. Just They're good them, aren't they? Yeah, I would I would say they set they set they set the they set the bar reasonably high. You know, where, you, where would you say? I'd give him I'd give him oh top of B. Yeah, I'd agree being, with that. Yeah. I'd agree. Top of B. Like definitely could enjoy a bag of Tang Fastics. Absolutely. Starting off strong then Starting with the Tang Fastic. What, what's next? What's next in the bag? <laughs> I just grabbed whatever I could from the train station. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh. Oh. We've got a Kinder Egg. A Kinder Egg. <laughs> a Kinder Egg. Now, when was the last time you had a Kinder Egg? Oh, a long time ago, mate. God, I think... Very long time. Mine was when we were in Munich Airport. Right. For Oktoberfest. Okay. Uh, when I when I went off to find some cream for my tattoo, I just grabbed one. They were just there, and I thought, "Oh, what a treat!" And are we sharing this one? Yeah, we'll we'll, sh we'll, sh one. we'll share it. There we go. At the end, we'll do the toy. Yeah. Oh. Mm mm mm. Now, I love a Kinder Egg. Yeah. Kinder chocolate has got to be the best. To me, it is. Though, if you wanted your chocolate fix, you probably wouldn't pick up a Kinder Egg. No. Just because of the small quantity of chocolate on it's there. It's more of the novelty, isn't it? Mm. It's the idea of that. You know, that, you get the toy. Chocolate's nice. They were cheapest chips. So. I'm I'm going to I'm gonna vote to put that in B as well. Yeah. What would you say? I'd put it just behind the Tang Fast. Great. What we'll do, we'll each kind of take a lead on. So, I'll say... Where I think that goes, you can challenge me. Yeah, that's fine. And vice versa. Right. So oh, now you're gonna nice. be uh, you're gonna be challenging me for whatever my opinion is. That's next. right. Polo. Polo. What kind of mentalist eats a tang fasted <laughs> a Kinder Egg <laughs> and, and then a polo? polo? Well, I don't know about you, but polos were never my favorite growing up. Like I just get chewing gum. Like mm. if I wanted a like a minty. I do like a polo. Oh, they're hard on your teeth when you're. They used to down. do citrus zest ones. They did. They were really nice. And they did the like, kind of like rainbow ones where it would more flavors. They did the fruit ones. I think they still do them. They used to stick together though in the packet quite annoyingly. Yeah. And they used to make a big plastic polo with loads of tiny baby ones in. Um. Do you know what? I've enjoyed that polo. It's a mint, so it's not really a. You know, it's. It's hard know. to categorize. I don't know, you know. Like, I can't remember the last time I had a polo. And having it now, I'm more disappointed in it. Really? Yeah, like, hurt my tooth, yeah. chomping away at that. <laughs> not that minty, you know. It's not like a mm -hmm. type of mint. It's kind of like a little one. I mean, 
maybe I'm being biased because I just had the Kinder Egg. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I, I'd give this a C. It, I'd give it a. C. Is it on the list? Oh, yeah, it's the fruit ones on the list, though, isn't it? Well, we're just going to presume that these are the yeah, okay. Yeah, I, I, it's a C or a D. Like, I think they've got a. I'd go with D. Yeah, if, if you're happy with a D. Yeah, like I, that's fair because putting it so just under the Kinder mm. in the, is a There's bit. There's a lot of stuff here, isn't yeah. There? And if you were a kid at Halloween and you went door to door and you got polos instead of like, you know, the Kinder egg, you'd be a bit disappointed. I think absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Right, what, what's next in what's the bag? Next in the There's only like tricks. four more, and then the rest we'll have to do from memory. To, yeah, no so worries. So what's next? Oh, I know exactly what's next. Sour, Sour Patch, Patch Kids. Kids. Okay, okay, I'm listening. Sour Patch Kids, which is strange because they're not British sweets, are they? They're American. Well, they, they, these are made in, in Britain, but they, they are traditionally yeah, American Yeah, I was going to say, because when I, when I saw the list, I thought, oh... Hang on a minute, this, these aren't normally, mm. right, but. Now, the thing with these is, they're definitely more sour than a Tang Fastic. Oh, absolutely. And when you want the sour hit, I probably lean towards these more than the Tang Fastic. Though I don't think they taste anywhere near as good. And they don't have that much diversity in them either. Uh, Tang Fastic, you've got some foam bits. You, yeah. don't, you don't have any of that with the. Diversity wise, yeah. Because the Tang, tang Fastics, you can, it's like multiple different sweets. Mm. Well, this is all the same one. However, I love a sour sweet. I same. really love a sour sweet. And if both of them were put in front of me and it's like you can have one or the other, I think I'm going to go with a sour patch, you know. I think you're right. I would Be, as Just well. because I want the, I want yeah, the sour I sweets, the man. Sour. So what so, about just in front in the B tier? Or would, are you I'm gonna, towards I, A? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put it on A. Only because I, I love a sour sweet. Like, I, when In terms of sour sweets, it's one of the more sour sweets you can get to have. Unfortunately, it's my turn to decide, so it we'll, is put, we'll put it at the top of B to, yep, to kind of that's compromise and, and please both of us. Oh, <laughs> the, the Tang Fastic just didn't want to move not then. having it. All right, okay, what we got right. next? Up next. Ooh, I can still taste the polo, you know? God, they don't have piss <laughs> sugar know. everywhere, those things. Yeah, I can uh-huh. still taste the polo as well. Right, what we're going to have to here? clean up after this one. Oh, Galaxy. Galaxy. Okay. Chocolate. Now, Galaxy is certainly not my preferred chocolate, though I know some people swear I know, by man. it. I am. Um, you know what's funny? I hate Galaxy. Mm. Like, I really hate Galaxy. I think it's the worst chocolate. It's sickly. I do like chocolate in general, especially with a cup of tea on an evening. Mm-hmm. Like chocolate. And a crumpet. <laughs> crumpet on a morning. Do you know what? It's really nice, that, but it is just a plain chocolate. Well, not for me. For me? Oh, well, it's your... It's your t- yeah, I was going to say for me. All right, it's not the worst. I'm not instantly like I'm going to be sick, but... <laughs> it's not It's not like a bush took great. a trial. I, I, I give it a D behind the polo. Yeah, so you'd rather have a polo than that? Oh, I'd rather have a polo than a Galaxy. I think out of, out of all the chocolate in the world, Galaxy's so behind, man. People, like you say, swear by it, and I'm just like, have you ever you just had a normal dairy milk? That's instantly better. <laughs> yeah, just a million it? times better. All right. What we got next, Chuck? Right. Up next in my bag of treats, bag of treats, um, Milky, bar. Milky Bar. Now, speaking of a better wow, chocolate. I haven't seen one of these for a long time. Do you remember the advert? The with Milky the kid? Bar Kids, strong Milky and tough. tough. Only the best is good enough. Yeah. And they also had the other, oh, no, it's not. I'm thinking there was the other one with the cars. But is that Go, mate, dig in. Is that Milky Way or something? The red car and the blue car had a race. Mm-hmm. Now, again, it's a chocolate. Mm-hmm. I do like white chocolate. Yeah. I'm not sure where I would place that. I think I would lean towards a C tier with that one. A C tier? Yeah, what about you? For me, I have always got time for a Milky Bar. Yeah. I think because they're, they're, they're quite thin. Mm-hmm. I've got a nice taste, but they're a bit sickly once again in terms of like because it's got that sweeter, sweeter taste. So C's fair for me. Yeah, it, yeah, it's like yeah, because like Kinder, the Kinder Egg's beating it still, isn't it? Yeah, I can't. Kinder let Egg it. is supreme. Yeah, Kinder Egg is supreme. <clears throat> right, we're down to maybe the last three or four. <laughs> I'm sure, you said that. <laughs> oh, what choices have we got here? Oh, this one's funny because. Uh, there was a deal on. There was a okay. deal on. So because of that deal, 
Do a love a deal, mate. Uh, I need to... Sugar all over the fucking table. <laughs> right. Okay, okay. Two Kinder Buenos, one Lovely. each. Great. One each. I'm getting a fucking free lunch today. I know, man. you're going to have all these at the side of your bed after. Right. Kinder, once again, is supreme to me. Absolutely, man. And the Germans these, know what they're doing. These, for a long period of my life, were the best. Yep. Like, the white ones especially, if I had the white Kinder Bueno. Now, I love the white one, but it's too messy. These. But these ones, mm, absolutely delightful. Mm. Like, what a treat. God, absolutely delicious. I think I think they just they just know it's how a, to do a chocolate. It's stunning that, isn't it? Now, here's an argument for you. Yeah. People like to say Kinder Bueno isn't a chocolate bar. What would you say? Of course it is. Yeah? Un- unmistakably, because yeah. Because they say because of the wafer and stuff in it, they say it's more like a biscuit bar. Oh, that's bollocks. Well, I've I've had the argument with people in person where they're like I it's said, a oh, my favorite. Yeah, a couple of years ago, I went, oh, Kinder Bueno is my favorite chocolate bar. Mm. I went, it's not a chocolate bar. Of course so it is. So, what is it then? So, it's a biscuit bar. I said, what do you mean? They're like, it's, it's close. They think it's closer to something like a blue ribbon. No chance. Uh, Don't say then, blue ribbon then, in the same breath. <laughs> yeah, then, uh, then I think, but I think it's it's a chocolate bar. Where are we ranking it? Uh, I'm going to give it a solid A. Absolutely. Yeah. Gorgeous. Like, I, like for me, I want to put it in S, but it's a bit messy and also once again it's like one of those i can have both pieces no more i don't like how they sell it as that's two yeah so like that one is two, two. Yeah. so you buy i bought an eight pack once oh, on amazon and, and it's it just, just four just four but obviously there's two sticks in each one annoying very annoying right <laughs> what we got next <laughs> i know exactly if i can find them these uh <laughs> Fucking hell, how much you got in the bag where the fuck is it you know, it's, a, it's hidden away. I've got one of them. Yeah. But we need two of them. You can't really share this one, I'd no. say. No. But you normally see these... What month are we in now, Feb? Yeah. You'd see these in April everywhere. Well, it's cream egg, isn't it? Cadbury's cream egg. Cadbury's cream egg. Oh, we're going to have to eat the whole fucking cream no, egg. No, you just have a... You can't bite have, have a bite and put it away, can you? Well, you, you can. Give it a whirl there. Cheers. No worries. Mm-mm-mm. Now, cream eggs are a weird one for me because the filling and the chocolate are both nice. But after a couple of bites of these, like maybe two, I just don't want the rest. Mm. Now, I've just had one bite now and I'm like, maybe I want a bit of the inside, but bar that, I don't really want the rest. It's a bit sickly. Well, I've had my full one now and... um. That's about as much cream egg as I want now for at least a month. I'm even I'm even washing my mouth after. I think we should put the cream egg at the top of the D tier. Yeah. It's not as good as a milky bar. Nowhere near it. It's better than a polo. Yeah. Um but it's yeah, it's just one of these where the mini versions you're getting, like the what was it hero heroes? Yeah, and like stuff the like that. um the, the bar. That's probably the better form when mm. it's the small one because you're yeah. just having one and you're like, perfect. But Agreed. the actual egg. Not that great. Agreed. Right. We need a palate cleanser. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. What's mm. what's hidden away in here? Let's find out. Do you know Raz don't eat sweets. What is that because of the tea for? He's just a He weird, never has. He's just it's just a strange no joy. It's like li- man's living like Oliver Twist. You're crazy. <laughs> like, starving I just wanted to more. Fruitella is a bad man sweet, you get me. My you get that, first, you get me. My first girlfriend's preferred. Um, preferred fruit chew like this really yeah. i wouldn't say it's my preferred but i would say uh these are i think they're very underrated yeah they're very distinct aren't they yeah compared to a starburst mm-hmm. first thing i'm noticing is the paper sticking to the chew which well, is for kind mine of it was fine well but, maybe it's user error feeling then. the chew doesn't feel very chewy oh, they're kind of soft. plastic here yeah it was very soft mm. But I am a fan of a Frutella. In yeah. fact, dare I say, I'd take a Frutella over a Starburst personally. I'm not sure about that one. No? Mm-mm. Where would you put them? I would put these. Top of C. Top of C? Yeah, because they are good. Mm-hmm. But for a sweet, let's say you're a kid and you've got some pocket money. and You're going down to the shop as a, a young lad. Yeah. And you, uh, you've, got, you've got a pound. So you've got to decide what you're going to get. 
you're never going to get the Frutels, are you? Realistically, not, no. with all the choice, you never. And then, if I was buying into the Frutella ecosystem, I would perhaps get some of the the long Frutella yeah. like double flavor I things that to, they do. I used to get Frutellas for flights to chew, so my ears uh, like take yeah. off, and they were they were the nicer one to have. But I personally prefer a Starburst, and I prefer a Chew It over a fruit salad. Chew it. I haven't had a, a, a classic chew it for chew a long time. Because is... chew it's have really branched out now into many yeah. different areas of business. Uh huh. You've got the sour stuff and the, the bonbons. Sour and stuff's brilliant. The sours are great. Right, I think <laughs> this... Well, it's not another... We've got four left. I think this might be... Oh, no, there's two. Two left. <laughs> two left. A Mars, Mars bar. bar. So we're going to leave without saying goodbye. <laughs> now, I don't need... I'm getting fucking full here. Yeah. I eat Mars bars quite often. Really? Yeah. Have you ever had one deep battered? No, I've never had a deep fried Mars bar. Oh, man. Like, it's something I want to try, but at the same time, I'm very paranoid about how that's going to taste. Yeah. I mean, I think a Mars bar is so good and such a staple that it's kind of underrated. It's like Mr. Brightside. You've seen it a million, you've heard it a million times. Like, you don't need to be having another Mars bar, you know? But I think Mars bar is great, and I would put a Mars bar personally at the top of B tier, unless you want to challenge me there. I'm going to have to challenge yeah? you. Yeah, okay. I think a Mars bar is pretty good. Yeah. But again, it's not the... <laughs> Are you scared of that? <laughs> no, I'm just trying to keep them in a, in a little pile of um, I don't think it's that brilliant. I think, like, it's, once again, a bit sickly. Mm -hmm. The filling's great. The filling's excellent. Brandon's instantly recognizable and out of all the chocolate bars if you see a mars bar you instantly know where they are where mars they are. are the largest family-owned company in the well, world i think the chocolate itself not the film but the chocolate itself is not as good as some okay. of the others what if we put it at the back end of b then i would happily put it in front of a kinder egg in front of a kinder egg yeah okay. even though kinder's supreme once again it's like it's a difference yeah itch, it's and like, it scratches a different you're itch. mainly getting the kinder egg for the toy okay Okay, and on to the the final yeah. final sweets in the bag. Then we're raw dogging. And then it. we're raw dogging memory. Malteser. Maltesers. Okay. I'm just uh, while you're opening the Maltesers, double checking that I am right in saying that they were the last. Yeah, they were. Now I very very rarely have a Malteser. <sighs> you're doing but, it wrong, mate. But when I do, I really enjoy them. I sometimes, as you can see, I'm a rather large gentleman. <laughs> Mm. Uh, I like to just get the big packet, the share packet for mm. myself. I could fucking, I could crush a bag of Maltesers like no time. I, I, I eat these like in five different ways. Sometimes I'll just put one in my mouth and just suck until all of it That's is what I'm dissolved doing now. and crushed away. Sometimes. But they're nice I, when they're, they're, they're cold and you can kind of chip the chocolate off yeah. of your teeth. Sometimes I'll just like keep them in my mouth. Roll it around until all the chocolate's off, and then it's just the wafer. Yeah. And then I bite it. Yeah. Sometimes I just shove it in. Sometimes I put like five in at once. I bet you do, cheeky boy. And sometimes, if I'm being a bit naughty, I'll bite half of one and then put the rest of it in my mouth to suck on. <laughs> so, Maltesers for me are probably another 80. Yeah. I love them. Like, I think they're so easy. Everyone likes it. I think for chocolate, if you don't want a chocolate bar, they're like, you go too near enough. <sighs> A tier, yeah. Because I'll, 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 I'll put, I'll meet you at top of B. Top of B, they can't be on on same level as a Kinder oh, Bueno. Oh man, really? I think Maltesers definitely could. Okay, behind the Kinder Bueno, yeah, then. behind the Kinder Bueno is fine. In A tier, yeah. Okay, that's fine. Uh, are we still keeping to the rule? We get one S each. Yeah, we get to force. So yeah, for when we last did this, we can force mm. something. We kind of got to agree and compromise on each one. Yeah, but then we can force S and force F. Yeah. So Absolutely. we get one of them each. Yep. Right now we're out of uh, we're out of treats to try, but that's already a good start. That is right. You know? So, Mint Aero, what's your thoughts on that? <sighs> Disgusting. It's an interesting one, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. It's like I I never really got the arrows. Like I I get why people want them, but mm. for me as a kid, I was like, why would you want that? Why wouldn't you just want like a nice chocolate bar? The the mint sometimes it hits the spot, but sometimes yeah. I feel like I'm eating chocolate after I've just cleaned my teeth. Yeah, uh, I did the mistake when I were when I was what year nine. I once went to pick up a normal arrow and I picked up the mint one, just completely on autopilot. Mm. Started eating it while walking up to school. 
I, I, I just felt sick for that first period. I was just like, the taste for me, when it's just lingering at the back of your throat, I was just like, oh, I need to wash this out. So for me, I give it an E. But for you, you might give it some. I, I'm going to, it's my round as yeah, well, isn't it? There you go. So I'm going to, I'll I'll meet you at the back of D. Back of D, that's fine for me. Right, very similar story. <laughs> Orange arrow. Probably worse. I'd agree. Yeah. I'd eight, put eight. that in an E. Yeah. No chance. No and chance. then a regular arrow. I'd put it a higher D than the Galaxy. Same. Above the Polo? Yeah, above the Polo. I'd get, like. So you prefer a normal arrow to a Galaxy? Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah, me too. I just really don't like a Galaxy, man. Like, there's only been once I liked a Galaxy, and it was in a hot chocolate. So <laughs> there you go. They are nice, the hot yeah. chocolate. Uh, after oh, eight. After eight is banging, man. That's interesting, because you don't like the mint air. I know. You like the after eight. Do you know why? Why? The after eight was, I used to get an after eight uh, for supper at my grand's. So she'd be like, here's... here's Penny pinch you. <laughs> she, well, she'd be like, here's a, a Horlicks or a... Yeah. Uh, what do you call it? Like a, a tea for bed, mm-hmm. and you've got an after eight or a rich tea. And I hate rich tea biscuits because I think they're the most bland thing. They are pretty. So dope. the after eight was the nice little, the nice treat. That yeah, you got. because like you are right, it's weird. The mint in the arrow, I don't really fuck with, but with the after eight, just tastes a bit better. It just tastes. It's a bit of a premium, and yeah. it's a bit of a treat. Where are you ranking it? Uh, I'm gonna give it. I'll put it B, just behind the Kinder Egg. Oh, okay. He's okay. Out. You, where, where, I did, where I did, you I did eat a box of them at Christmas, <laughs> and yeah, they, they were good. Why, what, what, but what? I only maybe want them once every five oh, years. Oh, that's right. Hang on, let's think about that because I've only had them last year once. Yeah, so you, you are because right. you're never picking up maybe, a box. Maybe of them. a C then. It's like top the Ferreros. You're never going to pick yeah, up like a box. Top of, of C. Top of C. Top Do you know what? C. I'm more comfortable with that yeah. as well. You're right. Right, what the hell is that? Oh, Blackjack. Licorice. Yeah, no. Blackjack Chew. No, 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 no. What are you no. saying? Yeah, F. 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 This is, this yeah, is. Yeah, do you know what there? Truly, we used to, when when you, when you we were kids and you saw someone having the Blackjacks, we, you just think they were a nonce. I don't, you, I don't mind them, but they're such an acquired taste and the paper <sighs> always sticks to them and I would yeah. never... I'd never like pick them out over anything so else. So they're they're by the same company that makes like wam bars and stuff, fruit salad yeah, and stuff. Yeah, yeah and out of all those, they're just the worst. Like yeah. they always get left. And anytime someone would try and like say, "Oh, do you want one?" I'd be like, "Don't even look at me." Don't right, even we got look our at first me. F tier. Yeah, get on it the out board. of here. Next, we got a bounty. Oh, this is a polarizing discussion. Do you like a bounty bar? Is the question? Absolutely not. Really? No. Nope. I don't I like, like coconut a, at all. I, I know you don't like coconut at all. Well, I actually like the bounty bar. I'm the guy who eats them in the in the tub. You know when they all get left behind. Disgusting. I eat them. But what I will say is they're not they're not brilliant. No, you know what I mean. I'm this lo- isn't a normal bounty. Actually, looking at it, it's kind of a red bounty. Is that dark chocolate bounty? Oh, I don't know. What's the red bounty? I don't know because the normal bounty is next to it, isn't it? Yeah. What is a red bounty? It's gonna be like. Coconut and summit, isn't it? Coconut and summit, like hazelnut or something. Yeah, maybe. I don't maybe. think it's dark chocolate, is it? I don't know. I'm just. Oh. It's a. Uh, yeah, it is it's dark chocolate? Oh well, even worse. The worst of both worlds. That. Uh, I like the coconut in it, but I don't like dark chocolate really. Um, it's probably E in it. I mean, for you, bottom you, of E is yeah, where bottom it's the of best e, it's getting. Bottom of E is fine. Normal one. Where where would you put you put it in F, wouldn't you? Surely. I put both of them in F, but I would raise it to the fine top top, top of E because I I'd, e I'd rather have bounty. a lot of other chocolate. You'd bars rather than have it. the bounty the bounty than the orange arrow in a heartbeat because yeah. I actually eat the bounties is what I'm saying, but they are still the last ones left in the tub. Okay, so what about the boost? Oh, right, so you remember the the drink as well in yeah, the bottle. Yeah. But there was always kids at my school. Different that were, thing, the different brand. Yeah, but they would always get the Boost Bar and then a Boost Drink right. for a weird combo, yeah. right? Awful. When I was younger, I was like, let's see what the hype's about, this combo. Mm. It's shit. The it, chocolate? The, both of them is Are you shit. kidding? I Boost Bar really... is, is, I would say Boost is an S tier. Oh, don't even start. Where would you put it? E. Well, I guess the we'll drink is a D. We'll meet, the, the drink is unrelated. <laughs> I guess we'll put it in C then and meet. No, in the you middle. can. You've got the right. You can. No, S it I don't want, want to S it. I've already seen something in there that I want to force. <laughs> All right, S-tier. C. C. It is. It's got to go middle, bro. Mid C. 
Yeah, mid C. Put it there. Oh, above the fruit sellers. Oh, behind the the. Oh. All right, I'll put it there. Yeah, that's that. it. What's this one? The the dark. Oh, is it the, the Bourneville? Oh, Cadbury Bourneville. Oh, so my partner's dad likes this a lot, mm. uh, and I I just don't get it. I think it's it's not that good. It's I I think that's just who been, is choosing this. <sighs> Out of the out of the shop, out of the shop. Older people. It's not. Truly. It's not a kids' chocolate bar, is it? It's not a kids' chocolate Definitely bar. Definitely not. Like you have to understand, sweets were originally. You know, you want kids to buy sweets mm. because they're spending all the fucking money on it. This is for the adult who goes. Oh, I've just, I've just finished my shift. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna pop home and I'm gonna read the newspaper. That's true. And I'm Eat gonna, my Bourneville. Yeah, Bourneville, because I'm a boring cunt. Oh, for me, it's got to be a. Late D. Late it's D. not awful like a bounty. Yeah, it's. Oh. But you like the bounty. Yeah, I put it. I put. I put it behind the arrow. Behind the arrow. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. No, no. I mean the the mint arrow. The mint. Oh, arrow. okay. Because I I think I'd rather have the mint arrow, even though I don't yeah. really like the taste. Yeah. Oh, this Cadbury's is, buttons. Cadbury's buttons is so good, man. It's just the same thing I in know, a different but they, shape. But they, I think it's because of the quantity. Yeah. Oh, and the the density they are nice. the shit. Do you remember the the McDonald's Cadbury's mm-hmm. big but, yeah. big Cadbury's button ice cream yeah. and you smashed through it with the straw? Yeah, it, um, that was cool. I th- I think these are, these are great, man. I think the best way to describe them is you'd have these to share when you're going somewhere. If I was on a train, I'd, if I had them, I'd say, "Oh, who wants?" Yeah, well, maybe. If I'm at the cinema, I might have them then. Mm. I wouldn't sit at home and have them, even in the yeah, smaller same. packet. I would never um, think to buy them, but. My daughter does love him a lot. so They are do, very much a kid's yeah, sweet, we, aren't they? It's like the opposite of the ball. I'd, I'd, I'd put it like top end of C. Okay, that, that works for me. Yeah, because like it's Cadbury's chocolate, I'm so it tastes that. nice. It's just the concept of it's a bit... So where would you put it. the next one, the standard dairy milk, which is the same chocolate but just in the bar it's, form? It's it's A. It's A. Brother, it's A. You're kidding. It's A. You seem pretty passionate about it. Why would, where would you put it? I'd put it very mid. I'd put it next to the buttons because really? it's the same thing. No, like the buttons, like when when you think of chocolate, the first thing that normally comes to most people's like mindset in the UK is Cadbury's. Yeah, for and sure. And when you think Cadbury's, the first thing you think of is this bog standard. I guess. It's probably the most consumed uh, Cadbury's product, surely. Out probably, of everything, yeah. yeah. Probably. And like... I could you could argue it for B, but like if you had I'm looking what's in B and the only two chocolates there are the the Kinder Egg, it's which not, I've already I, said. I can't believe you think it's better than a Mars. I told you the Mars it's insane. The bro. Mars is slightly That's crazy. The filling's nice, but I, I just like Damn, it. Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> hey, that's crazy. What about candy sticks? Oh, the these little, are fake cigarettes. The, thing. Kind of, yeah. They're, yeah, they're, they're just, the little the white chalk thing yeah. that you snap off. When I was a kid, I liked them, but I haven't had one for. Really? Probably. Do you know what, mate? Yes. I eat these quite a lot. Really? Yeah, yeah. Why do you I, get them still? I, you get a tattoo in them as well. Tesco has them, mm. and they're only like 30p, and I really do like these. The last time I had one was maybe when I was like 13. I used to like to pretend they were cigarettes yeah. and then just snap it. Mm. Like, I'd just snap it off. But I, I would put these kind of in a in a mid-C. A mid-C? Yeah, they're not my favourite, but I, I certainly like them. So you'd put it ahead of the boost bar? <laughs> yeah, but it scratches it. I mean, I'd put the boost bar at the top. Yeah. So, like, so oh, right. what about, would you point? put it over the Frutellas? Yeah. The after eggs. Definitely. So put it top end of C then. Happy out with yeah, it there? Yeah, yeah. Uh, from what I remember, I enjoyed them. I they think, are good, I mate. think, and they're cheap. They, they are like cheap as chips. Pieces. And you get the tattoo as well. Uh, Where, where's Car- the tattoo? <laughs> <laughs> it's an area you ain't seeing. Uh, Caramac. Uh, strange one, Caramac. It is. I used to love yeah. it as a kid. Mm. I used to, and then my taste buds changed, yeah. and then I kind of went off it. Same. Um, when I were a kid, I would have put it like top of C. Yeah, now probably. I'd probably put it like D, probably behind the r- polos. I yeah, that, I'm happy with that. Yeah, because I think I could still have, I'd prefer it over an arrow, but. All right, look what we got up now. Let's see what that oh, is. The Chew It's Extreme this is, Green uh, Apple Chew. This is, this is going to be crazy. These are Fantastic. These are S tier for me. I'm I not, agree. I mean, I I'm not even. Hey, I can't even. Bang them straight up yeah. there, bro. There's nothing oh, more needs to be said. They're so nice. <sighs> they used to be much rarer. Yeah. And God, when you found a pack of them and they do with the, the bag the, as well yeah. with the tooty fruit. I, I, mm. like, I love getting the purple and the green. I'd buy one each and yep. then put 
two in at a time. I go green, then the purple, and then two green, and then the two purple. I just, oh. God, say no more. Do you, it's annoying that you, like, you know at Christmas, you get you get your chocolate, and you get it in a tub, or you get yeah. it in a box. Why, why is there not, like, a big in tub of, of like chewing extreme? And stuff. I would sit there so happy if I had a tub of these. God, that would be great. I'd love it, man. I Once, when I was younger, I wanted to see if you could buy... You know the boxes when they're already in it, um, they're already selling at the shop. So it's with the individual. Uh, oh yeah, like yeah. the like the when I was the wholesale I must, I must have been like fourteen, fifteen. So we were in Costco and I was mm. looking to see if I could just buy a pre like a pre unopened yeah. box of them, just because I loved them that much. Yeah, they are truly oh, stunning. They're nice. What's next? What about the regular chew it? The regular chew it's kind of different because it's not sour. Mm. It's super sticky. They melt. Very different, totally yeah, different they, kind they, of chewing they it. They melt. They all, they're always stuck to the paper. The paper's always ripped. When you you mm-hmm. actually chewing it, you're chewing the paper yeah, as well. Yeah, there's always some paper in but there. But flavor-wise, they're so much better than a uh, Frutella. Like, taste-wise, because you have yeah, so they're, many they're different much ones. More, the flavor's much stronger. And I it? think it's more of a nostalgia thing, if, especially if you're a bit older and you think of sweets. If you mm. had a chewy sweet, a lot of the times it was a chew it. Um, then I tried one... Last year, and they've changed all the you know the recipe and stuff, and they don't taste nowhere near as good as they used to. Yeah, but I would put these like C. Um, I don't know where. Well, they've got to be above the Frutella, right? Yeah, they're probably above the After Eight. Yeah, yeah, because like I said, I keep going to back to the After Eights. Uh, you get it once a year. <laughs> like it's so nice, but it's once a year. What about the Nugget thing? This is shit. Absolute dog shit. This is awful. If, listen, oi, if you get this, if you were a kid and getting this, or you're an adult now getting it, have a word with yourself, because this is fucking awful. Straight in the effort yeah, at the very fuck bottom. This. I didn't even put it behind the blackjack, and we, I hate blackjack. We've got another terrible one coming up here. Oh, the fries yeah, chocolate yeah, cream. Sling it in, sling it in. F tier as well. Yeah. Where? I'd say it's... Above the blackjack, probably. Yeah, I'd say that's the top of F tier. Yeah, you have Who to the drag f- the blackjack annoyingly. <sighs> All right, finally, something good. Yeah. A classic M&M. Uh, so these are the classic. Not these the, are the chocolate M&Ms. Uh, yeah, I love. I do love them. I think, once again, if I'm going to the the bag of like chocolates, the small chocolates, I'm taking the Maltese every day of the week. Over the M&M? Yeah. No chance. Yeah, but for me, I would put it in B. Where would you rank an M&M versus Smarty? Oh, m and is so much better than a Smarty. Yeah. Smarty is shit. Do you know what it stands for? M&M. Uh, Sounds for Mars and Murray. Ma- yeah, because they do do the advert, so it will be the same mm. same company, of course. B. Uh, yeah. Where? So yeah, I'd put it. I'd rather have M and M's than a Tang Fastic or a Sour Patch. To be fair, oh, I'd have a. Uh, oh, it's hard for me. I'd have it behind the Tang Fastics, but you, like, how about this? You put it above that, but I'll have it behind the, the Sour, sour patch. patch. Yeah. Okay. I'm having a fruit teller because. <laughs> I need to clean all the... I've got, like, five chocolate bars just sat at the back of my throat, like... Well, weird I might have a polo. Mm-hmm. Fresh in the old. Um, Terry's Chocolate Orange, mate. I like a Terry's Chocolate Orange. Yeah, man. they're great, man. Um, the good thing with the Terry's, I mean, you might disagree here, but I very rarely eat a full Terry's mm. Chocolate Orange. I'll wrap it back up and sling it in the bedside you know, drawer. You do the thing where you smash it and it breaks. Yeah, yeah, you do that, and then... I. I I think they're good. Yeah. I'm a big fan of the Terry's. I, it, I'll only buy them when they're a quid, though. I buy them maybe like four times a year. A lot of the time I have a Terry's chocolate orange is like near Christmas mm-hmm. time and stuff. Yeah. Um, I do like them, though. I think the issue is, it's again, you, you, you look at all the other chocolate, and if you're limited to what your brain wants, it's always going to go with something that's got a, a bit more, of, you know, Terry's chocolate orange to me, it's great. It's a great concept, great taste, but it's a particular taste yeah. where you might not be in the mood for that. It's not like, oh, I just want chocolate. Yeah. It's like you, you want You need to be in the mood chocolate. for yeah. this. Yeah. They make a great, you know, when you get them in like shake away in a milkshake place, they make a really good oh. ingredient in those milkshake I've never places. tried that. I've had the ice cream, you know, like, mm. did McDonald's do in an ice cream a couple of years ago? I can't Maybe. remember. But I've had it. I've, I've put it uh, be above... The Kinder Egg. Okay. Yeah, because they're both firmly a novelty chocolate. Aren't exactly. They? You're buying them kind of for. And like I said, for Kinder Egg. Kinder Egg is a more of. If I was a kid, Kinder Egg would be above the. Mm-hmm. But now. Terry's chocolate adult. orange. Kinder Egg for adults. Yeah, exactly. There you go. Uh, chomp. So, Chomp is a weird one. 
because it's another one of those chocolates that you get in the big tubs. The selection the box, yeah. isn't it? Uh, and they're always one of the ones that's kind of left behind. Mm. I like a chomp, but how much do I really like a isn't chomp? It? Looking at that list. That's true. Do I like it? I'm, I'm starting low here. Do I like it more than the cream egg? I don't think I do. Because the cream egg, I'll I still have I like... I think that's the, the right yeah. point, like around there maybe. Uh, do you like it more than the caramac? I think oh. I'd rather have a caramac right now. Yeah, I do like a caramac. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'd even have an aero. It's uh, above the it's above the, the galaxy? galaxy by a well, mile. There we go then. So, Nature yeah. has decided. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> now we got the crispy M and M's. The crispy M and M's. Aside from the mini M and M's, which you can't get over here. These anymore. are the better ones. These are the these are the better ones. So these are great. I'd multiple put, ways to eat these. I would put these still just behind the Sour Patch Kids because yeah. I love a sour sweet. But I'm happy with that. Uh, mate. They are better than the originals. I'm happy with that. Oh, what's that? Crunchy. Actually? Crunchy is another weird one because it's got a great branding. Because you know when you're going to buy into it, you're going to fucking brick your teeth on mm. him. The honeycomb's nice, but it's not like, once again, it's like, I want if I want chocolate, because it's disguised as a chocolate yeah, bar. Yeah, there's so little is, chocolate on it. Yeah, it, it's It like, makes me cringe, the thought of my teeth going I, I used to love them, but I've really gone off them. I'd have it below the Milky Bar. Below the Milky Bar, where are we looking Bottom here? of C. Bottom of C. Oh, you have it above a normal aero. Yeah, I'd have it. Uh, everything can't, I can't uh, allow that in C. <laughs> everything, everything in D. I'd top rob a, top of D. Okay, top of D. Top of D. Top of D. Right, crunch Nestle crunch. I love these. I'm gonna be honest here. Yeah, I've only had a Nestle crunch maybe about ten times in my life. <sighs> That's enough times. No, to... but like, I'm going from like core. Call yeah. memories in my, like, Let me tell you when these are good. So you know the premise. It's like, is, is it like Rice Krispies that's in yeah. there or something? And it's nice to let melt while you're having a coffee or a tea and let the chocolate melt yeah, around. It's the, one of those. It's like a breakfast. Uh, it's like a breakfast. Cho- not breakfast, but like a lunch chocolate. You don't yeah, have a cup of yeah. It's, yeah. it's probably my favorite like big format. I would say I, like I liked it. I just, like I said, you, you're going to hate what I'm gonna, okay. about to say. Right, I would... Listen. With a cup of tea, I'd normally have a, a timeout or a blue ribbon <laughs> instead of it. But, you know, you put it where you think because unless it, you put it so high that I have to then step Well, step I mean, I'd rather have it than a Mars. Than a Mars? Yeah. Oh, I don't know about that. I'd but, rather have it than a Terry's chocolate orange then. Okay. What if we sling it there? Yeah, that's fine. I'm happy with that. Curly Whirly. Curly Whirly's a... Great, but they're messy. They are messy, but they are really good. Yeah, they're great. They um, all flake off everywhere, but they've got a real distinct yeah, taste. Yeah, the taste and pulling it, like, I see how far you can pull it mm. before it just like, dribbles down. They're going to be the first one gone, I think, in a selection box. Yeah, especially. <laughs> um, I think the only thing is, because it's so messy, and not only that, not even when you're just doing that and all the caramel and stuff slinging about. Even just a bite yeah, of it, just it's gonna, you're going to get everywhere. flakes everywhere. Um, it's, it's, it's in a B tier for me, but... Oh, yeah, it's probably ahead of the Terry's chocolate orange for me. Yeah. Yeah. What about you? I'm happy with that. I think that's really fair. I'm yeah. really, really like, agree with that. I do like them. I'll never say no. It's just like I always get annoyed because I'm always brushing like yeah. flakes off. And it melts if you don't get rid of it. And then it's like stains oh, your clothes. Is that what I think it is? It's a dime bar, it's mate. A dime bar. I've got a love hate relationship with dime Same, bars. Same, you know. Man. Like sometimes I, I really fancy one. Yeah. And then other times I really am like. Why the fuck would you ever get a dime bar? You used to get these. You used to get them in the Lunchables. Yeah, you used to also get the, like the small multi pack of them. Yeah, um, that were brilliant. I, it's so mid, isn't it? Yeah, it's a mid chocolate. Like, Let's put it right in the middle. Yeah, which is going to be mid C. Yeah, there. I'm happy with that. Yeah, it doesn't beat an after eight. I think <laughs> it's so different as yeah. well. Yeah, um, right, Cadbury Dairy Milk, milk Caramel. caramel. Uh, this is uh, for me. A B. So you'd rather have the non caramel dairy milk. milk? Yeah. You're kidding. Do you want to know why? Why? I get it. I sometimes when I'm having the caramel one, I get a little bit more sickly. Yeah, no, that, I get that. Like, the more normal sugar, one, it? I just go like that, I'll yeah. have the thing and then I'm full. Uh-huh. While I have that, I'll get halfway through and then I might leave it on the side for a bit later. Um if it's if it's in a product like ice cream or you know, something like yeah. something like that, absolutely you take the caramel any mm-hmm. day. Um but as the standard chocolate bar, I don't know. I just I just put it B. 
I just, I, it gets a bit too sick. Whereabouts in B? Uh, probably behind the crispy M M&M. and M. So you'd rather have that than a normal. Yeah, M&M. do you know what? But the crispy M M&M and M, crispy M and M, just yeah. has the advantage. Yeah, right? absolutely. We've now got what is that? F- uh, fruit and nuts. Yeah, dairy milk fruit yeah, and nuts. This is another one. This is my partner's uh, one of her favorite. How to fucking ruin a this product? This is literally a fucking pedophile's wet dream. This. Straight enough. Yeah, get the fuck gone. This is disgusting. No, no. You should. I'm sorry, because like the person who sat down and went, let's let's sling it with all our main dairy mm. milk products. Embarrassing. It's just. Fu- I mean, it's still gonna get a bit more embarrassing from what's coming up. What is that? That is. It looks like it's got some hazelnut dairy milk. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm I'm gonna, gonna say it's a hazelnut, hazelnut dairy milk. I mean, hazelnut's nice, but I think, like I said, you've already got two great dairy milk products. Why do you need to? If you want hazelnut, you're gonna get yourself a bueno. Yeah, I, I, I put this C. Imposter syndrome, bottom of C. Um, yeah. Now, what's this? This one looks this like is, a normal dairy no, milk. This is the stupid. Oh, it's got the jelly sweets and no, crackling. it's not. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. It's not, mate. There's one that's got the jelly sweets. What have we and already put in, in there? That's a dairy milk Oreo. Oreo. Oh, get so, the Oreo. So let's gone. put that there. The Oreo needs to. Where's the Oreo one going? Now I think this is kind of nice. Oh, I think it's not that no. good. I'd put it in C. I'd put it behind the the what do you call it? The hazelnut. Yeah. Is, wait, is that the hazelnut? Are we sure? Yeah, it is. It is. I zoomed in. There is a dairy milk which is like. Uh, Popping, popping yeah, sweets. No, yeah, it's, and it it's is not the worst that. one I've had. I really hate it. No, oh, now this. Dib dab. Dib dab. Novelty. Novelty. Uh, the sherbet's great. Uh, the sherbet the, is the good, y- isn't it? Uh, the, I was going to say the yolly, but the lolly is shit. It is. It's also, the, like, the, the stick always like ends up drooping after a bit. Yeah. Um, I find myself with these. I'll often just, after a couple of dips and dabs, I'll often I'll just yeah. chomp, chomp the lolly. And then pour the rest I, of the sherbet yeah, into my mouth. I, I got some in a, like an old sweet thing for yeah. uh, Christmas, like of my old favorite sweets mm. that were in it. Um, and I had like a couple of like wax of it. And then I ended up just using the lolly to shovel the shirt a bit. Yeah. And then I just binned it. The, they, I, think, I think they are good though. Do you remember kids used to just like put it on the table like it was Coke and stuff? <laughs> no. To, so at our school people would do it and they start shoveling it in the nose as if it was thingy. It was just funny. <laughs> it was just funny as if it were Coke. That um, would be awful. It, it made you feel shit because it goes straight to the back of your throat and then comes back up. Oh. It, it's all fizzy and stuff. Yeah. Um, I think from the novelty side, it's probably top end of D. Yeah, because you're never buying it to hit the spot. No, you're buying it because it's a oh, dolly no. mixtures. Oh, I don't really fucking like dolly, dolly mixtures, mixtures exhibit one of my least favorite things. About. These are like old people sweets. Yeah, they are. And, and it's, it's ironic it's because some, in a couple of years, people will look at some of the sweets we have mm-hmm. and go, old people sweets. And it's like, well. Dolly mixtures do the thing that I, that I really don't like that, you, that pick and mix does. And it grosses me out. And it's where a sweet that's coated in sugar. Yeah. Next comes to, into contact with a sweet that's not meant to be and it's got like some of the sugar on it yeah it's like when you get like a pick and mix and you'll have the like some, a chocolate some people have like a chocolate white next chocolate to mouse the, the, and the, the, the whale with the yeah, fizzy yeah and it yeah for me i never ever want a dolly mixture the cube is my favorite one like the, the kind of all i don't like it it's got it's got there's a licorice one in there isn't there um uh, there's like a coffee one the in coffee, there. yeah there's i'm just not a fan of them um i i always see them in when I normally see them, it's at an old person's house and mm. like a little bowl on the table. Used to use them in the Chris Chris Dingle. Yeah, I'm just not for me. I've never been a fan of them. Uh, I'd pro- probably put them at the bottom of E. I was just thinking that yeah. same thing. Can't be the worst mm. next to the things at the bottom. But Double Decker. Double Decker is another thing like the Chomp for me. Like they're just I. I'd rather have a different chocolate bar. Same. I'll have it. I'll have it. It's fine. Yeah, the concert. The, t- the temperature depends on how it how it goes down as well. Because if it's a bit too cold, then the nugget bit is just rock hard. Yeah, I'd probably put it. I put it just behind the chomp. I'd really don't. Yeah, like the Galaxy. I I I'll agree with that. I I, I would rather personally have the Galaxy of the Aero, but yeah. I know we're kind of meeting in the middle here. Uh, we got the double dip next. The now, double dip. 
I haven't that, had double dip for years. That's got to be worse than a dip dab, in my opinion. Yeah, because the, th- the, the thing stupid, dissolves. Yeah. The stupid thing that you got to eat it with. Yeah. And the sugar that it's with isn't as no. sticky as a sugar. But it was cheap. It was cheap. It was cheap. Like, you could go to the post office and get that. Mm. Get, like, the, what what were the, the sweets where you bit, it were like chewing gum, but it had, like, the jelly thing yeah, in it. You get yeah, that, you type. get that, and you get something else, and that's all under, like, 50p. Yeah. Back in the day, I had one of these in 2020 when we went to Zurich. Um, me and Bridie had one at the top of that mountain. Um, it's got a rank lower than the dip dab for me. I'd put it, I'd probably put it in E, E, top of, top e. of E, yeah. I mean, it is kind of shit. I think the last time I had one was in a, like a wacky warehouse, they're just not very good. No, but I respect them for trying something different. Yeah, these are shit. These man. lollies, these are <sighs> shit. If they came as just the thing without the stick. Yeah. I'd, I'd enjoy them. See, I, every time I have them, I like maybe put it in my mouth for like 30 seconds. Mm-hmm. And then I'm like, I've had enough of that. And I just sling it and smash it on the floor. That's the satisfying part, just smashing it on the floor. But I just think they're like, for a, what it is, a lolly, there's, I see already two other on here that I'd rather have yeah. than, than them. Uh, and I, like I said, they were part of that. Uh, nostalgia, like cho- uh, yeah, I mean, like the party bag, yeah. You know, like the, the at Christmas, I got them with the dip dab and stuff, and I've yeah. still not touched them. They're still just slung in the drawer. <laughs> Where do you reckon? Uh, probably like uh, just above the bounty. Yeah, Any, yeah. So you'd rather have a double dip? Yeah, yeah. The same way you had the double dip. Yeah. Until you, I think you would rather like have the double dip if they were both in front of you. You'd probably go, "Oh, this is like yeah, you're summer, right. I guess." Right, we got the uh, <sighs> drumstick squishies. Now, I'm not right. sold on the squishies. Yet. I like the squishies, except one of them. One of them's fucking vile. The green one. No, the blue and thingy one. Oh, the, this one. The bubble gum one. So I, I picked them up the other night, mm. um, when I was walking home. Uh, and I, I don't know why in my head I thought, oh, it's blue raspberry. So I got in, opened it up, slung it in my mouth, bubble gum. Yeah. And I was like, the a taste I don't want to have. You don't like the taste of bubble gum? <sighs> Unless it's like a blowy, like, yeah, yeah. A, a blowy. You don't like uh, that kind of something. artificial bubble no, gum flavor. No, I fucking hate it, man. Well, the normal squishums are more mm-hmm. sour, and I would say I like a sour sweet. So I, I, I care about these so little. Yeah. And they're such a basic bitch kind of sweet that you can have the full say on both of these. So, bubblegum ones I'd put uh, probably D just below the mint arrow. There? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. The squishums I'd put uh, probably just behind the milky bar. But you can That's argue that. Milky. No, do you know what, mate? I... I I care so little about them that they, they, they impact my life the, so little I'm not even ones, seeing them on the screen. The normal ones have a bit of sour to them, so. Do they? A little bit. Standard drumstick, how it was meant to be, as God intended. Now, again, I always just want it not on the stick. and The paper's the issue with this, they're man. So, yeah, the, 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 and the it, stick like is the so hard to rag off. Yeah, and you have to just... Put it in your mouth, sculpture it. You do, it, yeah. Suck on yeah. it until it kind of... And then even then, it's still too sticky and hard but, for you But teeth. they are nice, though. Oh, they yeah, are absolutely. pretty nice. I think I'd take this over the chew any day still. But yeah. once again, on the stick and the... Pay, it's like they, just, the they, they made a product that's like, okay, and then just went, put it we're on just going to make it yeah. more annoying. Yeah, that's for true. The consumer. Well, we'll put it... You'd rather have it than the chew it. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. Cadbury's Eclair, Eclair are great. Gorgeous, yeah. So I love hard. them. They're nice when they're cold and they're, and they're a bit hard and you have to suck them. Yeah. They're nice when they're like normal I temperature. Have a, I like to have them, you know, when when I've got a sore throat. Mm-hmm. Because when they're hard, I feel like it's really scraping all the shit off yeah. the back of my throat. <laughs> Very good. Um, yeah, I, I love these. I, I, and they're the first that I'll go for in a Heroes yeah. box. Yeah. yeah, they're normally my, like, I'd say, like, second, but mm. yeah. Yeah. Um, Ooh, is it? It's it's either top end B or lower A for me. Let's oh, go low A. Yeah, and in fact, put them in, put them in front of the dairy milk. Yeah, I'm because with that. I'd rather have the eclairs. Same. Now we're talking about the Ferrero <laughs> Rocher. Something we discussed earlier. Yeah, that, we uh, you kind of just have it once, <laughs> once a year. I do like them. I like them, but it's it's one of those where you, have you ever gone to like the shops where it's all like 
the Ferrero Rocher sh- uh, shops abroad where it's all yeah, it's all like done, and they do it all stuff. like it's like they do it all like that. They try and sell it like it's a like kind of a luxury. It is, yeah, it is sold it's as like, like an upper class. I'd kind rather of thing, have isn't it? I'd rather have a Kinder Bueno. Oh, same. Or I'd even I'd rather have fucking a load more chocolate than it. I guess the appeal is it's it's pompous in it. Yeah, it's, it's supposed to be like you give it as and, a... And as, it's a giftable yeah. chocolate, and but, you've got the, the full hazelnut but in I'm the a, I'm going to say something controversial. Okay. As a gift-giving chocolate, Toblerone's better by a mile. I would be inclined to agree with yeah, that. Yeah, so with that being said, I think these are C. Yeah, I'm happy They're slinging them in C. They nice. They're better than a dime. Let's put them in C. The better th- than dime. That's all I know. I've got to say the better than after eight. Okay, let's put it behind you. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're not going to be happy. They're not going to be happy. Imagine if someone who worked oh, for him just, like, just went, we've got to, we're have got we competing with Chewits at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> right, we got the Swizzles and Matlow okay. Fizzers. So the Swizzles are the, like the, the individual These are the one. Fizzers. So oh. it's the little pack, little buttons, mm-hmm. and little fizzy ones. And then the other ones, the... the Palmer Violets. Yeah. I hate the Palmer Violets ones. Yeah? Yeah. Where would you put the Palmer Violets? Oh, kind of like D. Like the, I, I, I like them more than everything that's well, in I'll meet D. Yeah, we'll get the Palmer Violets now, and I'll, I'll meet you at bottom C. <laughs> okay, Because well, I, well, I like them in moderation. Right. And I, we'll go back to the fizzers. And where would you put the fizzers? I'd probably rather have the fizzers than the Palmer Violets. Yeah. But, and I'd rather have the fizzers than... I'd probably put the fizzers... Around here, where the yeah, milky bar in front that, of the milky that's bar. That's fine. That's fine. Um, normally, I'd probably, probably, yeah, you know what? That's probably where they are. Okay. Probably where they are. We got the flake. <sighs> this is controversial. The sexy I think. chocolate. The problem with the flake mm-hmm. is in the name. It flakes everywhere. It's worse than the curly whirly. The curly was bad. Yeah, and they are elite with an ice cream. A Mr. Whippy. Yeah. A ninety nine. You know, they are all are elite. Mm-hmm. They're really bad for two things. You lose half the fucking product before you start eating yeah. it. Terrible for eating in the car. Yeah, terrible for eating in the car. But also, they, they melt fucking mega do. fast. I don't know if it's... Area. Yeah, it's like if you, you're eating it in the summer or you've put it in a pocket, when you open it up, you've lost half of it by it flaking and then the rest just fucking melts. The shame is they do taste nice. They do taste nice because it's Cadbury. So you it's know like I mean. an annoying dairy milk. Yeah. So with that being said, it's either C or B. I think I want a Mars any day of the week over it. Yeah, I agree. Uh, I, w- I would say C. I'd put it above the giant the the buttons. Yep. Yeah. Happy above with that. The, I'm above happy with the that. buttons. Now these the <laughs> sauces, sauces, man. I fucking love the sauces. God, man. they are they so are, shit. They are so good. They are so. I dead. love dissolving them. I like. Biting into it and just pouring all the sherbet mm-hmm. out. I just let it sit on my tongue. These are on the short list for my force into the FT. Oh, but I'm man. not gonna because there's I, there's worse in there. But I would have when I were a kid. This God, is, they're so shit, man. When I'd go across the street after school to mm. the sweet shop, I'd get like ten sauces God, and I'd just shove like them in my mouth and let it dissolve, and then it dissolved just a part of it. And the rest would be the hard thing. And then I just bite and suck until it was all merged into a nice paste. Man, I love them. These were like my, growing up, if someone had like, if someone was like, oh, we'll go to the shop, I'd go with oh. the intention of at least getting a couple well, of Well, so where would you put them? I'd put them at the bottom I'd and then put we'll them in level B. it out. I'd there. put them in B. So they're going to land in D. Because uh, I'd put them at the very bottom. you got to put them above the polos, man. No chance. Yeah. They're going in the middle. No, because you put E and look what's in E and I want to be how the difference. It's got to be all high, right, high all right, end. Fine, I'll put them there, but I'm not fucking happy about <laughs> it, all right? Okay, we've got the Caramel Freddo. It used to be called a Taz. These are the exception, I think. Yeah. The caramel's better than the normal one. Okay. It's, I would absolutely down, agree yeah. with that. Because it's, it's funny that it's just in a frog shape. That's I wonder why they stopped making them as Taz. I don't know. Maybe the license. Yeah, the, there was a lot going on. If you look at a lot of <laughs> there was a lot going on. Nine <laughs> eleven happened, and look, we just I, couldn't justifiably put Taz no, on the packaging anymore. It's just weird because there's been a lot of rebranding and stuff for chocolates since mm. we were kids. Like if you go and look at 
Like at the moment, the whole Cadbury's thing is they're showing like the anniversary chocolate bars of like the original dairy milk uh, like design yeah. in certain stores and stuff like that. Well, if, if I showed that to like my grand, she'd be like, yeah, that's what they always look like to me. <laughs> so, and a couple of years ago, like I said, the argument of how much a Freddo cost and oh, stuff like, you know what I mean? That, yeah. But it, what I mean is like kids nowadays or even the, the young, young adults of today probably only know these chocolate bars as like a Freddo mm, and stuff. That's true. Where's so with that being said, <laughs> this is, uh, this is B. B tier? Yeah. Next it's, to it's, yeah. What about above it's? It's, it's there. Cause yes. you're going to eat that in one and be satisfied. Yeah, absolutely. So then the regular Freddo. It goes to me, the regular Freddo is behind the dairy milk Cadbury's. Uh, the, 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 no, the dairy milk, uh, uh caramel. Yeah. Right. Okay. So that, it's like that. And that's the way it is. That's the way it we is. We got the fruit mentos oh, up next. I love a fruit mentos. Yeah, me too. Yeah. They're sometimes a bit too hard mm-hmm. and they and they kind of shatter. And I don't like the orange ones. I want to say I don't like, they're just the shit ones. Mm. Like I go through the Orange is usually the, the shit yeah. one, isn't it? Um, but I, 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 I pick these up I think semi-regularly. Yeah, I, I had them um, on the last two flights we had. Yeah. I bought them for yeah, the flight. I, so. I enjoy them. I, I put these... Um, I'd probably put these in a B tier. I'd put these in B, probably that, just in front of the Mars. The only sweet in the B tier. No, you got you got. Uh, oh, sorry, the Tang Fastic. And you've got well. this. Oh, oh yeah, so silly me. Uh, fruit fruit pastels. pastels. I just bought a bo- uh, bag of these. Today. These are excellent. Yep, they're really good. These are always a. try and suck them. Always yeah. end up chewing them. These are A. They are. I agree. That I think they're just behind the dairy milk. Here. Yeah, the, the back. I, I put my back. They're yeah, great because, like I said, you can get them in the uh, the pack I bought is the normal pack, but yeah. they do like a, a just a red and black one as well. Oh, red and black are the best, man. I like the green. The green's all right, but the the black for me was always like the I'd, black was like the the best. They were one, like crack it? Yeah. my oh fruit salad, fruit salad, yummy, 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 um, yummy indeed. These are. Taste of childhood, these. Yeah, these Taste are, of the tuck these, shop. These are good. Much better than their evil twin, the <laughs> yeah, Blackjack. Yeah, absolutely. I think the issue is they're a bit too tooty fruity. You know what I mean? They're a bit too... Uh, they're a bit sickly, I think. Yeah, they're a bit too, like... They're not juicy, sweety, soury mm. type. Of, they're more of a, like a... like Kind of like a fruitellery type. Yeah. So with that being said, it's somewhere near the fruit... Fruitella. I'd say they're not as good as a fruit teller. No. Um, Do you think they're better than the squashies? Yeah. Well, let's pop them there then. Yeah. That's fine. Now these boring dead ass these lollies out of the party bags go directly behind the other lollies in here. Yeah, I'm fucking yeah. not gonna argue with that. Uh, mate. In fact, I put them behind the bounty for me personally. Yeah. I mean, like I said, I'll eat the bounty because I don't mind it. But like, I just never want one of them I, shit lollies. I used to, when I were a kid, I'd get it from the dentist. Right. Um, after he's just checked my fucking teeth. So I always like really confused. And it's just because they're that shit because no one wants them. You know what I mean? They're just dentist trying to give trying them away. Yeah, I'm surprised that most landfill isn't filled with these fucking lollies. <laughs> Whoever, whoever is still selling shit, them, aren't they? if you know some like a little local shop that's selling these, do them a favor, take them, burn, burn, burn them, burn it down, burn it down. What are we saying on a fudge? This is easy for me. Yeah, it's a uh, low D. Low Same D. as a chomp, isn't it? Yeah, it's, and a chomp's better. Yeah, there. Uh, I put it behind the double decker. Yeah, really. Yeah, I like double decker. I'll actually eat. Um, wow. The the chomp, I'll eat. Fudge, I just, it, I just don't And it's to smaller it. as well, isn't yeah. it, Fudge? Right, it's this Galaxy I see coming This up. is a Galaxy Caramel, yeah, mate. You can vote on it because you know where I stand with Galaxy. Um, well, I'd rather have it than the normal Galaxy, but knowing what you say about Galaxy, why don't we put it just above the regular yeah, Galaxy? Yeah, that's fine. Because for me, Galaxy is just shit. And I always have people try and tell me, it's like, try it now. Maybe it's when you will. <laughs> yeah. um, let me tell you, I've tried it. I just tried Shut to up, shit. What about the Harry Potter giant straw? Oh, now you're speaking now, my language. I have an issue with these. Which ones are we talking about, though? Because there's the giant straws. The big well, ones. No, but there's there's two different types. Not that they're called giant straws. Yeah, so there's uh-huh. some that are flat like a pancake. Yeah, they're the ones. And then the ones that Harry Potter do are actually a bit round and bulbous. No, and they are... They're just the red ones, right? With the nice little kind of... Yeah, they're squishy, squishy, squishy. Yeah. No, and then they're, the giant they're one. gorgeous. 
Oh, see, I, l- I prefer the, the big the, flat Yeah, ones. well, that's what these are. The problem with these for me Stick is to your teeth. they sweat in the bag. <laughs> <laughs> you get a bag of these, it's it's there's moisture inside the bag and it freaks me out. <laughs> and because of that, even though I like the sweet, I will never buy one of them. <laughs> really? Yep. Oh, I don't, I don't, I don't but care. But as man. a sweet, got, I like the sweet. I'm already probably sweating when I put my hand in there. Just <laughs> that's what it was. Um, I love, I love them, man. Uh, I do like them. They are, but like, that's just why I don't buy them. I prefer them over tang plastics because the only thing in a tang plastic that I like more than them is the cherry. Is the cherry? But they did not you see cherry. when they did? Yeah, bag of just, just the, cherries. But but this is what I'm saying is, if we're going off and all, I, it's because it's just the they've they're all the they're a good straws. sweet, you know. Yeah, while the like I said this, yeah, you have a different range, but the 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 the, the alligators aren't. As good as the fucking strawberries and the the, I'm the happy to I'm one. happy to put them there above Tang Fastics. Now though. what's up next? Now we got the Haribo Super Mix, my oh. personal favorite Haribo. Are bag. these the ones that have like all the different type of sweet? They've got like the little jelly jelly man, man, which the is milk bottles. Yeah, though, yeah, I hate them. Really, they are sickly. Like in not in a oh, it's a sweet sickly way in a. This tastes like... I really like this because of, of the men. I, I save them to the eat men. Them. Yeah, <laughs> I, I love eating yeah, the men. Yeah, line mate. them all up and go, oh, them. you're going to get eaten today. <laughs> Commit genocide with the mouth. <laughs> can just imagine you at the side of the bed going like, come here. Soldiers. Come here. <laughs> Howdy. <laughs> um, okay, well, if you don't like them and I do... I would put these uh, like a C. So where would you put them? Like A or B? No, no, not in A. I'd, I'd put them in B. Okay, so let's put them top end of soup. Okay. Yeah. Happy with that. And then we've got the classic Haribo Star Mix. Now, these are, are great, but again, I would some never, of them are shit. I would never choose them instead of a Tang Fastic or a Super Mix. It's like the worst choose, of both see, worlds. I think I might choose them over a Super Mix because, like I said, I don't like the fucking milk bottles. Okay, well, should we put them just above the Super Mix in C? I'd put them low in B. Okay, that's essentially be- the be- same be- spot, isn't it? Because, like, there are things in there that I, I like. The rings, I like the bears. I'd rather have the fizzy ring. I like the egg. If and I want I the eat bear. The, I'll I buy eat, a pack of I eat, bears. I eat the yolk of the egg, and then I eat the oh, thing. They after. do the eggs now, just on their own yeah, as well. That's a bit shit, though. Mm, so. Too much. Yeah. Right. These, these fucking horrible thing, fucking these white are horrible. chocolate. These are like your pick and mix. They're always there. Yeah. And the shit. Mary, man. Uh, Mary learned her lesson about shoplifting with these when she was like, <laughs> you know, when she was like a, a young kid. Young. She nicked one from. Just one. She, she just oh, ate yeah, one in Woolworths, and my dad wiped the floor with her. That was really? like how she learned. Just about, like, one of them as well. You I thought she was going to do the pick at Woolworths. I used to fill them up. I'd do the whales, you know, yeah. and the big cola bottles. Yeah. I'd do that, wrap them up, and just put them in my inside pocket. Because <laughs> they, they haven't got a scan on them. They haven't got a scan. You know you what beat I mean? The system. So like, and I, I, I don't like these at all. These are shit. These are like E. Bottom of E, I would say. I'd rather have a dolly mixture. Yeah, put put my bottom of. Now I'd rather have the milk chocolate version, I but I still that don't want it above the dolly mix. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what? I'm kind of happy with that. Yeah, jelly right, babies. Jelly babies. Um, love them. Yeah, you them. just said about your little, little Di- man. Totally different though. Totally yeah, different. but like jelly babies for me. I kind of, I don't know. I don't love them. I'll have them, but I'll never go out my way to get them. If they're in a product or if someone's got some, mm. like if I'm at um, someone's house, and like, oh, do you I would one? buy one. I think they've got a really nice gelatinous kind of oh, See, that's the thing. Texture. I think they're a bit too, like, jelly. They're, they're stiff enough while also being soft enough. See, I like it more like this. Like, this is my perfect form of a jelly baby. Mm. Extra sugar, extra sour, softer, like, squishier. So with that in mind, I, these are like a C for me. Okay. Well, um, and, and let's with put that, them at the top of C then, because I like them. Yeah, I'm having work. I'd have probably put them in an A. Okay. We got jelly tots. Jelly tots are better than jelly boy, uh, jelly babies. Okay. I'd put these still top end of C. They're kind of like a fruit pastel. Yeah. But smaller, not as satisfying. Yeah, because they're tiny. Yeah. Um and. You, uh, they're not as hard uh, in a way like you know what i mean it's like they are hard but like a fruit pastel is like because it's got the density yeah and, and also the feel the, the juicier they're more desirable so with this i would put them at top of c or lower b maybe yeah maybe in front of the haribo normal mixture 
But you have to, I, in I, front I, of the star mix. Yeah, but the the issue is you have to think of like you're at a house uh-huh. with individuals around you. You open up the jelly tops and you say, "Anyone want a jelly top?" I can't see that many people going, "Yeah, go on." Or maybe they take one. Mm. If you open up the Harry Rose star mix, yeah, I see him taking a, a couple hands. more. Yeah. And with that in mind, that's why I don't know if I would put it in front. Taste wise, yeah, but like, let's leave them there for now. Okay. Eh? But I see your point. Now, the oh. Mawam joysticks. The joysticks are... Our first Mawam product. Because Mawams are brilliant. They're Yeah, they're good. They are brilliant. Uh, but the joysticks are a bit... They're, they're slimy. They're like they melt yeah. easily and stuff. Nah. Yeah, and the, the, so there's thin ones where they're wrapped at the top yeah, of the bottom. Yeah, yeah. Like, they're kind of just like an elongated chewing. And you chewing. get, like, if, if you're lucky, there's a few cola-flavoured ones. Yeah, yeah, but they're, like... They're, they're just like an elongated chew it. I prefer them over a chew it any day. Mm-hmm. Flavor wise, the cola and the apple, yeah. But the orange Would ones are shit. Would you prefer them to? I'd put them personally above a Mars bar. Okay, yeah, I'm I'm more than happy with that. Yeah. I thought you were gonna go quite low. No, but I'm, I'm no, happy like because it's my type of sweet. The yeah. orange ones always get left though. Fuck them. Right, what we got here? Kit Kat chunky peanut butter. Oh, you. You can't talk on this, can you? <laughs> no, I mean. uh, I'll, uh, I, I like it. Uh, it's like a B for me. It's probably... A B? Yeah, I like peanut butter, man. Well, it can't go in B. I'm allergic. <laughs> yeah, but that's why you're not vo- voting on it, really, are you? <laughs> right, okay, well, you... <laughs> you can't put it in F just because you're... Li- that's like me just going like... Ugh. Fine, put it somewhere. I would put it B uh, just above a Kinder Egg. Above a Kinder Egg, I like them, man. I like them. What about the regular Kit Kat Chunky? I'd probably put it just behind it. So you'd rather have it full of disgusting (laughs) peanut butter? Yeah, I like peanut butter. What about a four finger? Yeah, this is like top B. This is way better than a Kit Kat Chunky. Is Is it better than a pack of M&M's? The crispy ones? Yeah, I'm not sure. Not better than the crispy ones, but it's better than the Freddo. Yeah, for sure. Which is funny because you don't see a lot of love for Kit Kat. You don't, but, but it's are, happy just being. But it's, I think I tell you where they fucking love the Kit Kat, mate. You'll know this in Japan. Japan. God, they, they love but, the Kit Kat. It's strange because they want to just fucking ruin it. They do. They make here's like fucking seaweed flavor. Yeah. Here's mocha. Here's and cotton they have candy. Them, um, they're like mini vertical. Ones. Yeah, in their in their packaging. Have you seen the mini ones where it's yeah. still the four, but absolutely yeah, tiny? It's, it's crazy cute. Now we got the Lindor chocolate. Lindor, uh, a bit too sickly for me. Um, they are sickly for sure. I uh, I prefer. I think I prefer Ferrero Rocher any day of the week. Oh, surely <laughs> not, bro. Yeah, surely I think not. they're just. Well, you're putting the Lindor sickly. behind the Chewits. <laughs> Was it the Lindor chocolate in Zurich we had? Where? When we're in Zurich, what was your chocolate made of? No, that was just, just a, a, a Swiss like Army a one. Swiss yeah, Army one. Because they were. They, like, I'm trying to think the last time I had him, and I still... We used to have him in the office quite a lot. My brains go in like, nah, they're too sickly. I'd prefer a, an after eight any day of the week. Or, uh, oh, you prefer an after eight? Not yeah. Maybe not a dime. But like I said, I have a love-hate you can't, I can't put them above below after eight. <laughs> okay, why don't you put them... Where would you put them? And I'll... I'd put them above the Ferreros. Okay, what, just above them? Yeah. But behind the Chewits? I mean, right. I would rather have them than a right. chew it, but oh. we got to compromise. Oh, here, no, how we? about this? Put them behind the drumstick then. Because would you prefer a drumstick? <laughs> of course not. Would you prefer a... a I, would, I would personally put these probably like here. Oh, okay, then they got, they got to go behind the drumstick then. Yeah, I can't, okay. I can't. Like the chew it, okay, I could argue for you, but like... Fair enough, man. Right. That's why we do this together. Yeah, we compromise. Well, so we got, got the white lion bar up next. Um, white chocolate. I like it. Yeah. Lion bar. Lion bars are good. I yeah. think they're nice and chewy and uh, crunchy. I always have just half a lion bar for the time, and I have half. They a are bar. quite a job. They can make your jaw ache quite yeah, a bit. And they're always ruined for me now because of the kid who did the white lion bar. White yeah, lion bar. It's cringy. Because of that. Whenever I have one, my brain instantly says the yeah, thing, and so I go, "Oh, now kind of ruined a bit." Yeah. Um. But that being said, I do like them, uh, and I, I like bought them. A Forty pack of them. Really? Yeah. Off um Amazon. When so I was when at uni. when my little brother was at school, he used to have them um for like with his pack lunch or after school, and if there was some in the drawer, I just uh, if I were visiting my mum, I just steal them. 
I'm like, <laughs> fucking brilliant. You know what I mean? You do right. Sorry, sorry, Kai, but fuck sorry, man. I was like, line bar. And it was the white line bar as well, so it was pretty good. I would probably put this somewhere in mid C. I would put this uh, probably above the buttons. Yeah, I'm yeah. happy with that. I now, think... what about its milk chocolate counterpart, the standard Ooh, Where would you bar? put it? I'd probably rather have the standard one than the white one. I'm a bit opposite. I think I like the white one a bit more. But they are like pretty much... Well, let's just put them together. Put them in front of it if you want. And then, no, we'll put no them... but the, li- the original line was the he original. He paved the way, yeah, didn't it? So. Yeah, respect. It stood on the shoulders of giants. I love how we're one. saying that, but there's been so <laughs> <laughs> a couple, couple of uh, moments. Now, here. what's this? Licorice all sorts. Oh, fuck them. Get them in the bin. Bin! So you're bin! going F. Get him out of here, man. What I hate that? him. Are you forcing him? I, I am, that's my force. Is it? That's my force. Into F. F. At the Fuck bottom. off. Get out of here. I hate these. This is the, the guy on it that's made of the sweets. Yeah, the yeah. Pen. The Bassett's guy. Fucking hate it, man. These, Interesting. These are, if you gave them to me, uh, I'm either going to throw up. If you forced it into my mouth, I'm either going to throw really? up or I'm really going to have a bad time. See, I like them, but they're so inconsistently delivered in the bag that sometimes so I, the last bag of these I bought I barely ate any of them because it was all the shit ones I hate them but on. sometimes you get a good mix but say no more you've, you've used your force card can't the, wait to see what you're going to fuck no I already know mate mine's going to get yeeted straight <laughs> to right we got love arts um, they're shit they're, they're like a novelty right. no they're a novelty they are a novelty but like when you, you get them on the- a what plane do you get them on is that Virgin you get them on Maybe. Virgin Atlantic but when I look at the other novelty sweets, the like these are like classic in terms of it's like the branding is so recognizable. Mm-hmm. Everyone around the world knows them. I probably probably had them. The, the downside is taste wise, it's just not like as a sweet. They're kind of like you get in like a goodie bag. Mm. Like you know what I mean. I'm not going out my way to spend. I, I'll eat the little goodie bag size one, yeah. but when you get the longer one, I'm not interested. The little ones are fine, but they're like a Halloween one. You know, like me. I mm. got them in a bag. I'd have them. I'd put them near the dip dab. Yeah, probably probably just behind the dip dab. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Because a dip dab, like I said, the sherbet, they do give you a decent amount of sherbet at least. Now we've got a Milka chocolate <sighs> bar. You're going to have to speak on this. Why? I have a, a very, like, like a, I'm maybe in the 1% who think this. <laughs> I really don't like it. Oh. I think it tastes like advent calendar I, chocolate. I think it's second only to Kinder. I really don't like it. So we used to get it from Marcus's uh, parents from Germany. Yeah, yeah. They'd send like that, with the, those beer nuts that we like, and yes. some products and the short shortbreads and stuff. Um, but they always send it, and I'd always say it tastes like, you know, cheap advent calendars. yeah. yeah. Where it's just like bootleg chocolate made by a fucking random factory, and it tastes like that, and I just really don't like it. And every time I say that, everyone's like blasphemy. Yeah, that As is wild. It's they the do best. The, they do the one called. <coughs> oh, my mic stands falling. They do the one called Happy Cows, where it's um, milk and white chocolate kind of mixed yeah, and spliced I've together. I've seen them all. Absolutely delicious. Like everyone else in my family likes it. Everyone well, if you don't like it, and I really like it, why don't we just land in? Well, you, you know, you put this because, like I said. If it was to me, I'd say it's like, I don't like it a lot. I probably would put it in D. But you like it, like thing. So put it in B at least. No, if you don't like it, we can't. No, have but it in I B. am. I am B. Let's put it in. Let's put it in in C. Let's just put it here in C. Okay. Generic middle of C. Okay. That's fair then. Can't wait to hit the people to be like, I can't believe you did that. Now we're talking about the Milky Bar buttons. Milky Bar buttons. Do you prefer it to a regular Milky Bar? Do you prefer it to Cadbury Dairy Milk Buttons? Mmm, that's got you thinking, eh? Yeah, I... Oh, wait. <laughs> Might be some inconsistencies yeah, there. Yeah, like, we can't. So where's the Milky Bar? Milky Bar is there at C, near the bottom. But the buttons... The Dairy Milk... Uh, you know what? No, I prefer the bar bit over the buttons when I think of it. So I'd sling these uh, probably above the squish. Yeah. Yeah. Below the fruit salad. Yeah. Fruit salad, I prefer because it's more of a... What about Milky Way? Milky Ways are great. 
Milky Way is all really nice. And like the little alien, dude, is the little alien still on, the mascot oh, I can't for him? Remember, man, I've like, seen it in, yeah, in a long but time. But like Milky Way, oh, fucking it nice, is gorgeous. Yeah, it? I get the you know the party pack. Yeah, oh, yeah. And you get loads the of little, little ones. The kind of I, not as small as like a celebration one, yeah. but like a, a small but one. You can get a like a big thing of like thirty of them, mm. and I can eat them in a day. Yeah, they're very I nice. I could go back to them. These like, are probably day. the best in class in their category. I would argue these are A tier. I agree. I would probably put him. Oh, you know what? I put him above Maltesers. I agree, but not yeah. above a Bueno. No, Bueno is like Bueno is like love it. Delicioso, eh? Bubblegum millions. Well, you know my stance on bubblegum. <laughs> yeah. Strangely enough, I used to eat these as a kid, mm-hmm. just in the tube form, not in the that packet what I'm seeing there, but in the tube. But I would just like chew them till they all went together. Mm. And then I'd just like, after a while, just spit it out. Why did you rank them? The bubblegum ones. Mm. Like D. So I, these aren't my favorite sweet on this list. They aren't. No. But I like them so much and I'm so confident that we're <laughs> going to agree on, on what the favorite one is that I'm going to force them into S tier. Into because S. I think they're absolutely stunning. S. I absolutely S. love them. I'm using my false S. card. I think what? they are absolutely gorgeous. The bubblegum. The bubblegum specifically. Oh, you can have one and it's lovely. No. You can put loads in. And what I like to do, I like to kind of teeth on them. Yeah. I'd I'll have them right at the, together, right at the then... bottom, right at my back gums and bite down on my gums. And it's a nice pain. I fucking love these, <sighs> mate. I... I bought a retail wholesale box of these. And... um. We were finding them in Razzie's car for years to come. <laughs> and again, they're not my favorite on there, but I've got to... I know you're also going to agree with what the best thing on this list is, I'm pretty sure. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pull my card out there and force them into the S tier. <sighs> Sorry, yeah. mate. Hey, move, hey, move. You're right, hey. You used that's it. I got that's the card. Out. So I've got a force F tier left, and you've got a force S tier left. Yeah. Right, yeah. so we got the strawberry millions now. I see. I like these mm-hmm. more. But it's still not great because that artificial strawberry flavor is not that good. I think it works with these, though. Uh, no, it does, but then they lose the flavor. This is what I'm saying. It's like, you're like me. You don't just put one in your mouth and just chew and swallow. You put them to yeah, fucking I'm, chew I'm, out of. I'm distributing them I around. I chew them until they all start kind of merging together, and then I suck until like they get really thin and stretched out. It's kind of like how you have something like a drumstick and stuff like that. Mm. I like having that feeling. But I think they lose the flavor too quick. Um like I said, for me, I was going to put the things in D and I'd put these in C. But I know you fucking love these. It's all right. We'll, we'll put them in C. But I wouldn't put them low. I, oh, yeah. Okay. Top of C. Top, top of C. Because I, like I said, I do like them. I won't ever get it how they're displayed on this picture. I'd get it in, in the, tube. the tube. Because yeah. I'd just go, oh, mm-hmm. I'd just chew them up. Yeah, all. agreed. Mini egg. Mini eggs. Uh, I don't like mini eggs. You're kidding. I, I love like mini. mini I bought some today, man. I don't like mini eggs. Cup of tea. <laughs> you can God, crunch them down. I would, just, or... <laughs> I would just like to say Rob's go-to at the moment is cup of tea and then give one of like three things. It's going to be crumpets. <laughs> it's going to be obviously something like this. <laughs> Fucking mini eggs. Or it'll be like jelly tots or something. <laughs> love it's a cup like, of tea, mate. Cup of tea's and, great. And I love mini eggs. But I, 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 these, when I was younger and I'd get for... Easter, mm. an Easter egg, and it be the mini egg one where it comes with the mini eggs in it. I just always gave the mini eggs You're away. You're kidding. I just don't like them, man. I think they're, like I said, it's a bit too What do you reckon then? For me, it's like top end of D because oh. I, I recognize that they're all right. Okay, better than a cream egg. Yeah. You can have it better. Now, here's a similar egg. thing now. Cadbury Minstrel. Uh, sorry, Galaxy Minstrel. <laughs> what am I talking about? Cadbury Minstrel. <laughs> sorry, eh? mate. It's been a long night. Uh, no, I like a Minstrel, but it, is it, what is it? The what they're called? Rev Revel. Revel. I prefer Revel any day. Yeah. These, well, the Revel doesn't have the crunchy sugar, I know, crisp sugar shell. But the these, I don't like the chocolate. Mm. It's still Galaxy chocolate. Yeah. I think that probably the 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 gimmick of him the. The nostalgia of it being like that, I'd put it above the normal galaxy. But yeah, what above the normal galaxy yeah. chocolate? Okay, I'll I'm happy with that. Where is the normal galaxy? Oh, that's quite low for the <laughs> minstrel, mate. 
put that's it, quite low for a minstrel. <laughs> Where would you put it? If you had I'd rate a minstrel quite high. I'd put it kind of just behind an M&M. Oh, I ain't put it at the bottom of C then. Okay. Yeah, bottom of C. Now, what about munchies? Munchies are nice. Yeah, they are munchies good. Munchies are nice. Just the right amount of biscuits. Yeah. Just leave you want it a bit more. Yeah, have it with a cup of tea. <laughs> yeah, do you know what? I do have it with a cup of tea, mate. It's lovely with a cup of tea. Uh, I think they I, are... I prefer like, them in the long bar yeah. than I prefer yeah. in the bag. Uh, I think I'd put these just in front of the chewets in C. Yeah? Yeah, because like when I look at everything I else, yeah, do you know what? everything else in front of it... It's up, yeah. There, yeah. Because everything else in front of it, I think, with, without a few, without like a few examples, um, like I think I prefer everything else there. Peanut M and M's. So I know you don't like them, but I put them just behind the. Uh, you know what? I'd put them just behind the crispy M and M. Oh, better than a regular M M&M. and M. Yeah, because I like peanut butter. Right, we've got a real dead one now. Oh, bin it. Bin it. Fries peppermint cream. Get rid of it. Get rid of What's it. What's the other one? Fries chocolate cream. Get rid of it. These are shit. Because they taste... Someone used to tell me they taste exactly like After 8. It's gone and straight I tried, in the F. I tried it and I spat it out straight instantly. Straight in the F. Picnic full of peanuts. <laughs> I mean, do you want my honest opinion? Yeah. I, I can't remember even what a picnic tastes like. But it's full okay, of peanuts. Well, I'm going to put it in an F then. Okay, you put it in there. I'm going to put it in an F. You put it in an F. Right. Mawan pinballs. Brilliant sweet. I, I'm going to say something here. Okay, I'm listening. These are high A tier yep. for me. I would agree. I love these. Same. I get them. I, I can go through probably... If I had two packs, I could go oh, through. Oh, I couldn't eat two. I could. Not in the same sitting, but in the same day. Yeah, oh, I probably couldn't. Oh, absolutely. Day. You used to only be able to get them in the three, yeah, like the a pack with mini, just three in. But now they do them just in the mile mix. Yeah, I've bigger. got some in my bedside. And the cola Thing, ones are ladies. so good. Yeah, they <laughs> the are. The cola ones are so and good. They know man. that they give them the least. You give you them the yeah. least. And when you, yeah, bite I, it, I love when these. you when you bite and you suck, you oh, yeah. you really get the nice bit of sour, yeah. not too sour. Like, oh, I love them. I think the only downside is sometimes it makes my stomach feel like I've got concrete in it. They're quite. Uh, blow okay, the so given that, I think it's above the Maltese, uh, behind the Milky Way. Yep, I'm, yeah. ha- I'm happy with that, cool. mate. Now cool. we got Rainbow Drops Oh, here. man, I love Rainbow Drops. I haven't seen Rainbow Drops for years. Rainbow Drops. They're nice, though. Yeah, they're nice. They're really soft. They're like, the the idea of them is great. I used to I used to want to just have them as a cereal. Because I was like, they do, yeah, they are kind of they're kind of like cereal s, but they just sog a fire as soon as you put milk yeah, on it. I've tried kind of it, dissolve, I guess. but they they taste so they nice. Are nice the aren't problem they? is they dissolve faster than the fucking flying saucer. Um, I would say these are like B tier. I I'm, love. I'm them, happy man. putting them in a low B tier. I'll put them. Um, just in front of the Kinder Egg, if that's all okay. Right. Yeah, that works. It's another. Like, they're kind of a novelty. Yeah, novelty. Well, aren't they? Novelty, but. It's one of those that if I saw him, if I walk in a shop and I saw him, I'd probably go, oh, you know what? I might. I might just grab them. And what's this? Oh. oh like just, a, just a bonbon, basically. Just, yeah, like I, if it was the Vimto ones, absolutely. They are good, though. Absolutely. This just looks like some bog sand ones. This is a Tesco one in the picture. So well, let's a, just say it's it's any kind. So if it it's could the, be the Vimto, Vimto one. ones, it's a high B. If it's... There's some other ones where I think they're a bit shit. Well, it represents all of them. So, where would you put a bonbon? Probably high to mid C tier. Well, how about we go high C then? Okay. Top of C. Not above a million. <laughs> it can't be better than a million. You've already way. put a fucking million. <laughs> okay, yeah. Do you know what? You're right. You've already... All right. Fine. Fine. Fuck you. Right. Lemon refresher bar. <sighs> God tea. Yeah, really yeah, good. I can eat so these good. all day yeah. long, man. Yeah. Big or small, yeah. fuck them all. I exactly. love them. <laughs> am I right? Am I right? They are, they are brilliant. Um, they're so tasty. Love them. I love all the fucking shit in yeah, it. Same. I love just, the only, there's only one downside to them. They're hard as fuck and they fuck up your teeth they in do, terms yeah. of like. You have to kind of almost like. I chipped a tooth. Keep them a bit warm. Having one of these and a uh one bar at the same yeah. time. Oh, I, the had, double. Like, That'll I, be it, like, I took half the one bar. Flew too close I was going to the like sun. that and then I took the refresher, specifically the lemon one, and I just fucked my tooth up. 
But being said, like that being said, it's A. A. Come on, man. S. Oh, sorry. Oh, did I you forgot. think I was going to put it in no, there? No, I, I, I mis- misread. I'm like, uh, whereabouts in there? Oh, it's probably uh, above the Mawams. Oh, it's probably above the Milky Way. Yeah, yeah, I'd agree. The Kinder Bueno is just so good. It is. Um, Revels. Revels. Yeah, so these have, what What flavors are in it? Coffee. Um, There's like a minstrel, but without minstrel. the shell. Yeah. There's like a Maltesery one. There's a raisin in there, though, yeah. isn't there? Uh, these are kind of like, these Copper are, D. These are dead as fuck, man. I'd put it above. This is for someone who can't commit. <laughs> oh, I need it. And I don't know what I want. I don't mind him. I, all right. I, how about this? How about this? Let's put it. I I say let's put it above the Squishums bubblegum. Okay. Yeah. I'm happy with it. Because down there, I, I think everything else ahead of it, I'd probably prefer. Rhubarb and custard oh, fuck sweet. this shit, man. I, I, I don't like rhubarb and custard. Me either. I think it's just... You have to fucking... be a certified non Yeah, this these. is like a Jake Varley special. I don't Proper. even know if Jake Varley likes them, but I I presume that's what he likes. It's like something he'd have at home in a This in is a what bowl. his mum would say, yeah. like, do you want a sweet? And this is mm, what she brings out. Yeah. And it's like... Not too many, Jakey. Yeah. Like, come on, Jake. Mum, I want him son. <laughs> where are these fuckers going? Uh, F. Fuck them off. Fuck them off. Um, I don't care where you put them in F, to be honest. I'd rather have them than anything else in F, so All right. I'll put them there. Galaxy Ripple. <laughs> oh, so is this like their flake? It's like is a it, poor no, man's like flake. A, like th- yeah, so it's, no, it's like a... Um, it's a t- timeout or whatever, isn't no, it? No, what's the, what's the fucking Cadbury version called? The flake, but it's got chocolate over the top. It's like oh, an encased twirl. flake. Yeah, this is like a twirl, but from Galaxy. Okay, well, I think I'd like it more than a normal... Galaxy, Galaxy, yeah. I think I'd put it uh, just behind the Polo. Yeah. Oh, wait, where is it? Where? Where's the guy? Go- I'd put it just behind a Chomp. Okay. Yeah. I'm happy with I that, like yeah. Well, so. I've, I couldn't, couldn't imagine oh. picking up a ripple off the fucking shelf. No, no. Rollos. Rollos are good. Yeah, they are good. Yeah, good. <laughs> I do like Rollos. <laughs> Rollos are, it's so easy to tell like when Rob likes it because you just have to go, yeah, they're good. Right? <laughs> yeah, they are um, good. I like them. Um, I do think they do get a bit sickly in terms of like yeah, when you're going I down d- the thing, the further you get, the more you start <laughs> losing yeah. interest. But the first like four or five, yeah, you're like, hit, God, these are good, nice. Totally. Um, it's like a, it's probably like, uh, it's probably a top C for me. Behind the millions for you, you could have. Okay, yeah, I'm happy with that. Yeah. Now we got the round trees randoms. Right, so I like the randoms. Yeah, me too. <laughs> they, they hurt my teeth more yeah. than any other sweet, which is strange because then, uh, and I don't. They're good though. They're a good mix. You they're got the good. foam ones. You've got the it's the like, ones with the juice in. They're kind of like a weird Haribo mix in terms of like you know, in Haribo you kind of know what you're getting in the super mix. Yeah. But these are like. A poor man's version mm. of it in terms of like you're still getting nice random things in there, but I don't know if it works as well. Yeah. As the th- so with that in mind, I I'd give it. Where did we put? Where did we put? It's I'll got, tell you what. On another, I only ever want the small pack of randoms. Yeah. I don't want like the big. No. The big pack. I put them behind the Haribo Superman. Yep. Yeah. Right up there. Cool. Skittles, classic Skittles. Oh, love Skittles. Same love Skittles. B. I don't know where in B, but I know they're like everything else we've talked about that C below. I, I like. would. Do you know what, mate? I'd put these at the top of B. Yeah. Uh, Maybe below I'd, the sour patch. I'd, I'd if it was sour, sour skittles, the green, which I then, bought today as well, yeah, I'd then, be putting yeah, them in S. Same. I'd be putting them in same. S. Same. They're so good, man. Smarties. Oh fuck, Smarties, man. Like for me, this is going to sound stupid, but for me, it's like bottom of D. Really, bottom of D. Um, I just think they're pretty, pretty shit. I would have probably put them in B. So I was about to meet you at the top of D. Top of D is fine. I think like... I guess, I mean, it kind of makes <sighs> sense. It, in theory, it's kind of like a mini egg and you don't yeah, like the mini egg. I just, I, I, but it's not just that. It's like whenever, once again, if option is smarty or M&M. It's always got to be an M&M. M&M. Right? And then if uh, I've had, when I have Smarties, I'm always chewing it. I'm like, this tastes like shit. I've been it's telling not the chocolate. Good. Yeah, like, they, they do taste cheap. Yeah, and also the t- flaking out the shell. Oh, I can't be arsed with it, man. Snickers. I like a Snickers. You don't, because you, <laughs> yeah. you don't like nuts. Uh, you don't like nuts. Um, I, love, I love a Snickers. Uh, 
I love it just about as much as I love a Mars bar. So you've got to be joking. I'm gonna put it next to the Mars bar. You can't even you can't even have it, bro. Now we've got to choose another peanut one, the Star Bar. I don't like a Star Bar that much. No. No. What's in a Star Bar? Oh, I couldn't tell you, but it it's not that nice. Mm. It's normally like next to fucking boost. Boost bar in the fucking shop, yeah. uh, and I must have picked up only a handful of times and gone, yeah, not for me. And with that, I'd probably put it like in D. Um, put it, put it, put it behind the arrow. <laughs> put it behind the arrow. <laughs> behind the arrow. Serious <laughs> business. That's Starburst. It. Oh yeah, I love a Starburst. Yeah, same. Um, some of them are shit. Orange. Orange. Fuck the orange, orange man. Fuck so orange shit. gang. Green gang rise Green, up. The lime ones are nice, but... The, I like to get these in the pouch as opposed to oh, in the... the pouch. Yeah, I can eat a okay. full pouch of these. No problem. <laughs> no <laughs> fucking issues. The issue... No issues. The issue <laughs> is uh, you do have all the paper left over, yeah. but that's a byproduct of any cheese. I really. think these are better than the... Oh, it's hard. Yeah, I think they're better than Chewitz. So wherever Chewitz are, I would. Where are Chewitz? Chewitz a C. I'd definitely put these in at least a B. Okay, how about this bottom of B? Okay, bottom of B. No worries. Now what we got here? What does this shit? Strawberry bomb. Oh, it's bonbons. Bonbons again. again. So we'll just put, put them, them next, next to the, to the other C's bonbons. Where were they? The C top of C. Uh, Fucking hell, that's criminal putting them in there. We've got what the fuck is this? Oh, Strawberry laces. fizzy laces. Yes. These ones. Now. Depending which fizzy laces it is from which brand, these fluctuate. I don't ever want these. I love them. They always taste like that fake strawberry. I love them, man. I love them. What I'm saying is some of them taste shit. Some Mm. of them are like the real, like, the ingredients are fuck all. They're like M&S, like, we've not got any sugar in it. You know, we've not got any artificial. Fuck off, man. (laughs) I want, like, real. I want them extra (sighs) artificial. Yeah, I want them extra, like, fucked. Um, Some of them, like, like... But um, I prefer rainbow belts and the cola ones to the strawberry. A rainbow belt, always. Yeah. So for me, I put these low B. I know oh. you wouldn't, but I love the... T- the I'd the put t- these in like E. All right, let's meet in the middle. What we got then? Low C then. Low C. Not the bottom of C. Yeah, Can't, that's in the middle. Bro, look what's ahead of it. All right, we'll jump it up to before the chew it then. Yeah. But again, I'm not happy about it. <laughs> then we've got... Strawberry laces. The ones, yeah, strawberry laces B. that are fizzy. B. No chance. B. E. I, I take them e. all. I take them all and shove them in my mouth. And if it was the Vimto the, These are one. not going in B, bro. <laughs> no chance. Well, put them next to the fizzy ones then. But I have them ahead of them. I prefer these over the fizzy ones. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah. Then what's this? These are the pencil oh, ones. Oh, pencil ones are shitter. Oh, they're better than the other two. No. These <laughs> We're are, really disagreeing these are, here. These are like low end D. I'm happy putting them there, even even as... Put them there. Well, ahead of the bubblegum fucking yeah. squishums, yeah. Mawam stripes. Mawam are good at selling you the same thing in different yeah, shapes. Yeah, but these are the... It's the, the, the they're really good. They are. <laughs> I prefer them to the uh, joysticks, even though yeah. it's the same exact yeah. thing. Uh, the joysticks, like I said, are my least favourite. It goes joysticks, these, well, and where, the pinball. Where do you put the standard Mawam Chew, which again oh, is the, the same thing. thing, and it comes in a pack of five? Lower than you got to fuck about with all the packaging. The lower than the joystick, I guess. Yeah. So for these, so these are higher. The uh, higher than the joystick. Higher than the Mentos? No. 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 Oh yeah, you know what? Yeah, they are. Yeah, I would agree. Like higher than the Tang Fastics. Yeah. Higher than the Straubs. It, which if it's the straw, yeah, the giant straws behind M and M's though. I'm happy with that because the pinballs just taste so much better. Pinballs are great. Yeah. Well, the pinballs have the zing that, yeah. that these sweets don't. Right, Toblerone. Toblerone. The, right, so it's already better than Ferrero Rocher. Absolutely love a Toblerone. Yeah, I do. Um, I probably love it more than what am I looking at there? Buttons, yeah. Love it more than a Rolo, yeah. More than a a Claire. Mm, do I love it more, more than, than a Freddo? Yeah. More than a Kit Kat? No. All right. Well, there we go. I prefer a Kit Kat. It scratches a different itch. Yeah. Like I said, Toblerone's good, but like, once again, I'm not buying it. And it does have a bit of fanfare, doesn't it? It's yeah. a bit of a ceremony as a, as a Toblerone. All right. Toffee Crisp. I like a Toffee Crisp. Gorgeous. Yeah. Oh, I really fucking love a Toffee nice. Crisp. 
Really nice. We used to get these at uni and watch Prison Break every night. Oh, really? oh Toffee Living Crisp the dream. Spa. Toffee Crisp. Oh, Delicious. Oh, gorgeous. When I the only the only issue I'm having now is I'm looking at the top of B here because I like to when I the, for me I go and like initial like oh do I like it yeah mm. so I'm looking at the top of B do I like it more than Skittles I don't think so they're so different though I know but this one this one you've got yeah, the, the yeah, yeah, money yeah. enough to buy one or the other yeah. <laughs> I'm going off me with a bland appetite yeah, yeah which is my brain gonna go it's always gonna go more towards the sour. Over chocolate any day, yeah, yeah. and I know that's crazy saying because the Kinder Bueno's a top of a but Kinder Bueno's well, in a league of its, its own. A, yeah, so for me, I put these just behind the crispy M and M's because crispy M and M's. Okay, I see crisp, the logic. You've articulated M&Ms, yourself well. I can there. I can just shove a couple in my hands, shove it in my mouth. With this, it's one of those where you got to just eat it like a, eat yeah. It normally, I tell you what though. Lovely with a cup of tea. <laughs> really nice. Yeah, yeah. Right, we're down to the last row of items. We've right, got... I'm, I'm curious here. Have I said what you thought I was going to put in S? No. No, okay. We have got <laughs> toffees. Bog standard. Wait, you toffee. skipped some it? Nope. Oh, normal toffees, like bog standard. Like... To- just toffees. Oh, can it not be Werther's original? If it was a Werther's original... It's not a toffee, though. Oh, you're right. There's but, a word that's original in the list, right, you dickhead. Uh, normal toffee is shit. No, normal toffee. I don't like it as much. Like, I, I Put it this way. It's not shit shit, but it's, it's like... It's kind of boring. You would never yeah, pit, take like, a bag I of toffees, but if there's I, one sat on the table, you'd certainly slump it down. I'd take <laughs> one. Um, I'd take one. Uh, I'd put it like low in C, then. Okay. Above a minstrel? Yeah. Above a dairy milk Oreo, Oreo. No. All right. Toffee. Now these. I have never had one. Oh, lovely. It's the only one on this thing that I've that I could eat that I've never eaten. These are lovely, but uh how lovely I don't think it's <sighs> the taste of them are oh okay. I think it's above just the normal squishums. Yeah. On C. Yeah. God, it's a busy list, this, isn't it? Yeah. Down here, yeah. so you'd rather have a Milky Bar button. Yeah, I'd rather have a Milky Bar button. Tootie Fruities. Tootie Fruities are lovely. They're now. great. They're, they must be discontinued. I I, 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 I cannot find them anywhere. I tell you when I last had Tootie Fruities, yeah. didn't even have them in the packet. I got them from one of those fucking machines. Where you oh, put yeah. The old ones as they well. They must have been some yeah. dead. And, and they do them in... They used to do a pick and mix, a round tree pick and mix. Yeah. You get tutti frutties, um, jelly Shelly, tots, jelly and fruit tots, pastels. Yeah. But the sugar off the other two goes <laughs> onto the <laughs> tutti frutti. It, it does. Um, tutti tutti frutti is gorgeous. Yeah, I'd put it like probably. Oh, what 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 have we got? C. I'd say I'd go for A tier for a tutti oh, frutti. I can't do A. Can't for A. I could do B. Okay, let's make it do B. B. I think I prefer. Um, it's not better than Malum's. I see the Malum joysticks oh, there. Yeah, it's got to be better than the Malum joystick, man. Do you reckon? Yeah. I would have them just behind the Malum All right, joystick. all right. Because Malum's just... All right, okay. Like I said. All right, toxic <laughs> Where am I going to put this? I wonder. Oh, I wonder. Yeah, just sling it in S because we love a sour sleep. No. We love a sour sleep. It's worth saying. Not just the best sweet. <laughs> Probably one of the best things to eat ever. I, so here's the thing. For you, you'd put it the top end of S. I, for me, I put it just behind the chew it. No. No, listen, listen, only because I don't have to run the risk of fucking up my taste buds for the day. Having the, like, you have to understand, like, no, if, I, you're going, I, I do if, you're, if you're going for a meal uh, late in the day, but mm. you've started your day and halfway through it, you go, toxic waste, look at him, fuck him out. Sling it in your mouth. Sometimes you get that thing where it dissolves a layer of like saliva I on your tongue. That. I I don't mind it because I love the s- sourness, but then when I go and eat something, it kind of puts the taste of everything else for a weird tint of like I when can still I, when, taste it. When me and Jake landed in Texas in October, yeah, the first thing that I saw in the airport was a giant. Oh tub of them. yeah, I've, I've seen. And do you know what I ate? So many. And I love them. My t- like it makes your tongue peel, yeah, and I just love it. So I it's don't so satisfying. Like, I don't really love the tongue peel, but the sourness is the sourest that I need. It's the it's it's about as sour as things get while still being like 
actually yeah. nice. It's like you can you actually when you suck on the sourness, you're actually appreciating it. It's not like it's so sour that I can't even think mm. to the point where I don't even want it anymore. I tried, like I said, those world sourest yeah. balls, and it was just like they were so sour to the point where it just was disgusting. Yeah. Like chemically disgusting. The, the other stuff in the toxic waste range is good as well. They yeah. do the smog balls and they do like some chews. Yeah. And they're all good. I love them. Do you know what? I, I, I'm only going to say this quickly. I've just noticed we they, they didn't include on this list three things that, yeah, they're, pro, they're not British sweets really, but I would I would have thought they would have put them in there. They haven't got uh, any uh, brain liquors on there. Yeah. There's no juicy drop pop. Yeah, like the classic yeah, kind of kids. I loved touch the, shop I, type. I used to love just getting all the thing and fucking coating the shell of it. Do you remember the ba- baby bop? Yeah, baby. Oh, is that what is that what you're on about? No, the, baby the bop suck. slings out. Yeah, juicy you, drop you'd... pop. You pull it out, and then it had like the jelly yeah. thing, and you squeeze yeah. it out into the crevice. God. So things like that, I used to fucking love. Um, I used to love, and uh, like, yeah, they're not on here, but in spirit, you've got toxic waste, which kind of takes all the sourness they need oh, and I puts it in waste. perfect branding as well. Agreed. Like, it's it catches the kids. Catching. The only problem was that when I were a kid, I used to think it was like, you know, those sweets where you open up and it's loads of like, they're kind of like pezos with the small discs. Do you know what I'm talking <laughs> about? It's like they look like tiny um, Palmer violets, but they're tiny and they're like shit and it tastes like pez. No, dispense ones them. and there used to be this thing where like if you got like i remember i got like a barrel from like i don't know like fucking orlando or somewhere mm. of sweets but it was just these fucking things because i thought it was like proper nice sweets inside it they weren't had it and they were dead so when i was when i saw a toxic waste for the first time i thought oh, i was gonna you have that kind of and then i off. saw someone have a toxic waste and go oh <laughs> and like, and I went, on a minute i went oh. sign me up yeah. for some of that Right. Turkish Delight. Fucking shit. How do you feel about a Turkish Delight? I was going to use my Force F2. <laughs> oh, well, to fucking sling, sling it in right there. Right at the back. Yeah. I think the shit. Disgusting. Twirl is, uh, like I said, where did we put the fucking... The Galaxy Ripple. Yeah, we put that in bottom of a C, didn't it's we? Yeah, D. Or D. Well, I'll give the Twirl... Uh, I can't put it too high on C. But remember where the flake is as well. This is the just f- a flake, but we Yeah, but the I prefer just the flake. Same, to be so fair. So I put Commit this in it. behind the... the I put this behind the white line bar. Okay, that works for me. Twix? Twix are good, but they're like a, like a shit... Sometimes I crave a Twix. I don't really... I don't really crave a Twix ever, but I'll eat a Twix. It's like a biscuity... I would class I, a Twix I, as I, more of a biscuit. Yeah. I, but, oh, we, we're opening a can of worms, yeah. man. We've had a Kinder Bueno. We have. So, for me, I actually, I'd have a Twix with a cup of tea. Yeah, uh, sign tea. me up. But with that being said, out of all the sweets there, I walk in the shop, I go, right, I've got two pounds, I'm going to get a chocolate bar and a sweet. It's never going to be the choice of the chocolate bar ever, I think, unless I was against, like... At Morrison's own, Tesco's own chocolate. It's, and it's pro- yeah, I think so. For right. that, I'm gonna put it. I'd put it behind the Milky Bar buttons in C. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, like I'm happy with that. Yeah, I think I think that's fair. Werther's original. Okay, yeah. I I I have to say, I really like him. My great granddad used to every time I visit him, mm. always just pass me one. I wouldn't even say out to him. He'd just be like, "There you go." <laughs> And I'd be like, hey, it's polite. You got to have it. You got to. And then it got to the point where I'm like, oh, I, I do like having a Werther's mm. every now and then. I think once a month I have a Werther's original. Yeah. yeah. And there's something about just sucking on it for a couple of minutes, keeping it in your mouth while you're talking to someone. It's just nice. I uh, absolutely love them. Yeah. I. It's the first thing I remember having where it was so nice. I was just trying to taste it more and yeah. more as I was eating it. and I love letting it go so smooth as oh, fuck. Oh, I've everything. got some in my bedside table yeah. now. I'm telling oh, you, I've good. got everything you need I in there. I think the only and problem with them ooh. is, you have, like I said, if, if you're into it, they're great when you have to just suck on them. But sometimes I get halfway through and I'm like, I just want to bite it now to have another one. Yeah. But you can't because you just chew your fucking They did tongue. make a chew one, but yeah, it wasn't but as good. Yeah, but this I think that's the downside. It's like halfway through, I want to put another one in 
to re start sucking mm. down, but I've got to get rid of the other yeah, one yeah, first. And I, started, yeah, mate. and I, sometimes I'm like, it's kind of half the fun gone there now. So with that in mind, it's somewhere in B. It's got to be. I can't put it in A because I don't think I prefer it over Skittles and stuff. <sighs> but I do think it's better than a M and M. I think it's better than an M and M. How's about we put it behind the table we're on here? Okay. That's fair. Now we got a Wamba. Love a Wamba. S tier. S tier. I will I'll die on this hill. You give me you get so you Oh wait, you can I can't you can force I'm, one in. Why did we both agree on toxic waste? Yeah, yeah. Oh then yeah, sling it in. Oh wait, didn't I use no, I used my S on the chew it's actually. No, right? because we both um well, do you know what? I like, I love a one bar I, anyway. I, for me, they a one bar only. I don't know when f- when you last had one, but they're certainly last different. Week. To, oh right, yeah, me too. Last week, but they did used to be better. They used to be a bit tangier. Yeah, bit they did, and they had more of the the, the, the bits in. Bits in. Now they're not. They're more smoothed out. Mm. But there's nothing more. These are the blue raspberry ones, aren't they? They're, they're the purple. Yeah, the yeah. the one classic one bar. I love them, man. Yeah. The taste of it. They're good. So the sour and also the juiciness. Oh, the only downside, like I said, you either have to sh- keep stretching it out until it's smooth enough to that you can actually chew it, or you have to risk snapping yeah, it, but, and then you fuck up your teeth. Yeah, that's but, true. But, oh almighty, great. this was my favourite sweet as a kid. Up until... 10p, weren't they? Up until I was like 14. At 14, I started to branch out and go, I'm going to try this, I'm going to try this. Yeah, but <laughs> I'm going to try the that, others. If I had some pocket money, I'd go to the post office in Aston... Yeah, I go in, take get some stamps from a gran or drop off a card for her, and I'd go in with my money and I'd get like five fucking one bars and just have them all. They're great. I I love them. Genuinely, if you rocked up to me with a bag of sweets and it was just that S tier, I'd be really really happy. Yeah, if you hey if you're a fan and you rock up with those sweets, <laughs> I'm gonna take the picture yeah, and I'll, you know I'll keep the name in my head. You forever. can ask me that question again. <laughs> Because God Almighty, they are so yeah. good. We're down to the last five now. We've got last the five. wine gums. Wine gums are strange because on paper they should be like kind of like a fruit pastel, yeah. but oh. they only two of them are nice. I don't like any of them. I like the black ones and I like the red ones. Black is my favorite, but I don't like. Any I of them. think they're tough. And they ups they, they they do the concrete thing where it goes in my stomach and um and also you, you fucking chewing the fuck out of it with your jaw for not that juiciness you know what I mean it's not you, you know no you I do normally I, I, you, I don't like them like when you're eating a sweet and you're thinking the fact that sweets are bad for you they fuck up your teeth and they also ruin your appetite for the day and it also can fuck up your stomach you have to understand that. You're not, you don't care because you, you're getting the reward of it tastes nice. Mm. Wine gums don't have that fix for me. I um, agree. And with that being said, it's got to be oh, what we got in. The, it's, it's probably beating everything for me in D, except obviously the space uh, flying saucers, but you, you drag that. But in C... I have wine gums than a dip dab. Yeah, the, 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 the black ones, yeah. It's not the black ones, so it's a pack. They're not all going to be black. Yeah, but you also remember why the dip dabs in there. You don't even finish all the sherbet. Okay. Okay, well, what about this? If that's bottom going is, into C, what about it's got to be at C? the very bottom. Okay. okay. And I'm not happy about it. <laughs> You're not happy about it. A couple of these. Whisper Gold. Uh, it's probably better than a Whisper. Just you reckon? a bit. Well, Whisper's not in there yet. I would put them together. But I'd just put Whisper Gold in front of it. Yeah. Yeah. I would rather have the gold. Would as you well. rather have a whisper or a twill? Whisper. So put whisper top. I'd of rather C. have a whisper than an arrow. Yeah, but the twill's at fucking top of C nearly, isn't it? It's an arrow. Arrow's in fucking D. Right. <laughs> right, let's Is put it. it to, yeah. No, nah, it's not. Arrow's there. Oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah, and twirls there. <laughs> All right, I'd put it above a twirl for sure. I'd put it above a flake and a white lion. What about you? Uh, I'd put it just behind a flake. Like I said, the flake's yeah. got the gimmick yeah, of... Yeah, yeah of the it, it, it... And then the whisper falls in just behind yeah. it then. Yeah. That's Two fun. more. Two more, and then we are and done. Then we're done. It's been a long it one. It has this. been Fucking a long hell. one. But it's been fun. It has been. We've reminisced. This is, this is 
you know, it's it's nice to discuss these things because most people don't sit <laughs> sit and really chat like this Deep with a mate. They normally just go, oh, what did you watch? Yeah. Did you see the football? Yeah, have you heard about who's performing in that arena? Uh, massive, innit? Massive. Um, Yorkie Raisin. F. Sling it. Sling it. Absolutely yeah. dog it's shit. behind the Turkish delight. Oh, no. <laughs> I've... I. I brute force right. that in. Okay, I'll brute force it. But yeah, the Yorkie raisin, how to ruin summer half decent. Raisins, raisins in man. It. I, I, I'll say this. When the normal raisins, and they used to be in the little fucking box, I used to like them as a kid. Oh. I haven't had that little box of raisin for years. However, so I've, made or whatever I, the was. What, you know, like a uh, scone. Yeah. I fucking hate it because it has raisins yep. in it and stuff. Anything that has raisins in it, like a fucking I agree. fruitcake. Well, raisins uh, fucking, are fucking get disgusting. It out. It's grim. I like, like I said, can I have a raisin on its own when it's in its thing? But other than that, it's fucking shit. Well, the last uh, one. Yorkie. The Yorkie. We've been going for an hour and 50 minutes. Wow. God, I need a haircut. The So the Yorkie has probably one of the most recognizable, like, slogan things, like, mm, not for not girls. Not for girls. Um, it's not even that good. It's just shitty Ch- yeah. chocolate in, yeah. in chunks too big to yeah. enjoy properly. So with that, like being said, like I'm only going off. I'm not going to sling it in e. No, but I mean I'm, it's 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 chocolate, but but it's not. It's, that good. it's like I think I'd rather have an arrow. I, I don't. I, like I'd rather that. have an arrow. Like, yeah, easy. So let's put it. I would put an. I would put it. The only chocolate on here that I'd say it's better than in this D tier, is the Bourneville. I think it's better than the Revels. Because I think I'd rather... Do you think it's it. better than the Mint Arrow? <laughs> no. And there we have it. Yeah, that's it. There we have it, guys. It's only taken us nearly two hours. There we go. God, all, all right. right. So, now, what you've all been waiting for, let me just scroll up there so you can see everything. What you've all been waiting for? The toy. The Kinder Egg toy. All right, let's open this. Oh... So, oh, thanks very much for listening um, and for watching. This was just a little bit of filler that we wanted to to create. We've been talking about doing this for ages, and we're in the works of revamping the podcast. We're hoping to get a new set and um, some new people on it. So, that's why there hasn't been any podcast activity. But rest assured, one of us is going to take charge of it and get it done, and it's going to be better than ever. Um what does that look like you've got there, Chuck? Spaceship with a fucking face on it. Spaceship with a fucking face on it, it says there, I believe. <laughs> God, man, what happened to... Do you remember when... Kin, like, quick one. Kinder Egg Toys used to be fun. I got, in 2013, I opened it up. Little Porsche 911 toy oh, in there. It was cool. great. I've still got it somewhere. That's cool. At the moment, it's like, what the fuck is this? I also had a, an advent calendar when I was a young kid in Germany and you got Kinder Egg in it every day. Oh, really? Mm. Right. I think I'll save this. What? The... Well, well, that's it. This is the toy. Brilliant. Cool. <laughs> Thank you, Chuck. It's been a pleasure. Thank you, mate, for having me. It's been a good chat. You oh, know? we will see you. Sooner rather than later, I hope, with yeah. some high quality produced podcast content. Absolutely. In the meantime, let us know if you enjoyed this. Yeah. If you want to see another video like this, this is zero effort for us to make, yeah, as we, you can tell. We, so we just enjoy having a chat. If, if you enjoy this, let us know what else you want us to tier list and we'll um we'll crack on with it. We'll crack on with it. Hey. Right. And a bit love guys. You and leave you and see we'll see bit. you Bye. next time. Bye bye.